and the adventure can begin. We are live. Hey, everybody. It's me and Frosty. Yeah. We're playing a jank game. What was that? No, we're not. No, we're not doing hardcore. No, fuck that. Fuck you. Code Sonic. That's yeah. important. I nearly thought of putting something funny there. and I was like, nope, not allowed. Nope. Actually. Not allowed. So, uh, this is Outward. This game is jank. We've played this before. We're going to kind of just do a tour, I would say. Is that right? That's about right. Yeah, we're not going to do every single cave. We'll do a bunch of them, though. Do a bunch of them. Uh, th this game just has problem <laughs> problems, like this hairstyle. Oh, thanks for the sub, Lel. Seven months. Okay, I'm gonna also open up your stream so I can look at your chat. Oh, this is some beautiful... And this time it's going to work because the resolutions aren't messed up because it isn't a game from the million years ago. Uh, so the intro, we have to act separately for just a little bit and then we will be grouping up. There's what style are you doing? I, I picked a generic one, to be honest. Okay, that's the, fine. There's that's fine. There's plot in this game. It's not great. It's not in, in the beginning we have a blood debt because we fucked up or something. It it honestly doesn't really matter. Uh, Frosty, let me know when you're at least standing around. I am loading in. There is lore. I hope I spelled code sonic right. Oh god, I hope so. We'll we'll explain why we named ourselves Code Sonic. Yeah. I was just playing Monster Hunter, so this this game has weird controls as it is. And I'm gonna have to remember how to do anything. Did not spell it right. You didn't? Nope. Easy to check though. Wait, how do you check? Just I just opened the menu and looked for the option. Oh, good point. I've got it. I'm fine. Code, Sonic, all lowercase? Uh, cool? I think it's the first letters are capitalized. That's what I had before, I thought. Code, Space, Sonic. Oh. Yeah, two words. Two words. Like I know. Those names. How do I fucking run? How do I? There we go. Get it out. It's fine. It's the up button for me. Up on the four buttons. It's great. I forget, I don't think it's worthwhile killing the... There's like a, a special secret boss in the intro scene. We could never get back to this area, the starting area. Uh, but I'm gonna I forgot there was anything going on in there. Yeah. This. I'm going to go just take a peek around. I think we can at I'm least grab... the things from an axe. Yeah, I think there's a weapon or two. Oh, seaweed. Oh boy, for our magic we won't be using much of. Because the magic system is really interesting and also not very good. And also the shadows... The shadows are not very good. I... Mm. Gotta get the gaberries. Oh, the gaberries. They're actually pretty good for what they are. Why did I wash up naked? Why did I have to find someone else's clothes? Were those my clothes once? <laughs> the water is no known for stealing... The water is known for stealing your clothing. No one else is naked, is all I got to say. All these other corpses, they wore clothes. Maybe that's why they died. Oh, maybe. Oh, wait a minute. There's, um... Before I deal with the board, there's a, a little, like, uh, stream. There's something at the end of the stream. Where was that? So, Outward is a game that has a lot of survival mechanics, and they're very mean. If you accidentally drink unclean water, you are fucked up for a while. Uh, if it's too hot or too cold, you can die very quickly. It's rough. It's not a great time. Um, I would say some of the mechanics aren't too bad to deal with. Like, as long as you know what to not do, it's not too bad. But, like, the desert is kind of a nightmare. Yeah, because shadows don't help you. You would think, oh, shadows. No, it's yeah. just your equipment. The same Breath of the Wild. Sadly. Sadly. Why can't we just play uh, Breath of the Wild uh, co-op? Because <laughs> uh, they killed the emulator that would have that. Oh, yeah. To be fair, they were trying to profit, and that's like 
That's over the line. <laughs> Granted, that does tend to get Oops. some negative attention, but also it was just to pay the devs a, like an amount of money for their work. Yeah, but they were still using someone else's property. Like, yeah, I know. It's, it's like if they came down on just an emulator, I'd be pissed. But if they were making money off of it, it's like mm, that, is that that hyena is in the water over there. I'm going to ignore that one. I swear there's a chest back here somewhere. How do I attack? There we go. So combat just feels kind of bad in this game in general. Things don't really give you opportunities to strike. You have to really go out of your way. And some enemies are just kind of dicks. Yeah, I'd uh, agree with that. I got trunk. Okay. Hold on. Don't you? Don't you get no ideas now? However, when you actually start getting into the um, when you start getting bad. real impact damage, I should also probably explain the way that damage works, unless you wanted to, Frosty. Uh, not particularly. I'm fighting the hyena, <laughs> taking all of my brain cell. So there's a red bar. That's their health bar. Wow. That uh, gray bar is not their. St Why am I walking like this? Why am I walking like that? That was weird. Um, that gray bar is their poise meter, and you hit them with impact damage, and it goes down. And if it goes all the way down. They fall over, usually in a way you can't capitalize on, which makes you question why it's actually a mechanic in the video game. Also, I just got bit, so I am now bleeding, which will oh, not I'm stop. Oh. Well, lucky you, because bleed's worse. Yeah. Uh, you won't stop bleeding unless you bandage yourself. So I am going to eventually die if I don't kill this guy. There we go. I don't think I care about this tattered. <sighs> Yeah, well, they um they were kind of forced out for the settlement thing. Okay, bandages. They were also apparently. I just watched a video that touched on this earlier today. Apparently, they were literally like hacking Nintendo so that they could, like, pirating stuff so that they could make their mods ready day like the release day. Oh, that's not good. <clears throat> yeah, that's that's way over the line. And that's probably why they didn't go to court, is because if that got investigated, that would be much worse for them than mm. just, oh, we gotta shut down. Sorry, guys. Like, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna talk to the guy. Uh, I I'm just finished my fights. First. I got some bread. Guy tried to talk me out of getting some bread. <laughs> I got a straw hat. I'm a ninja now. Or I'm a, I'm a samurai now? One of the two. You don't really get much out of... Wait, am I still bleeding? That's... Oh, well, I guess I'm just still bleeding. That's fine. I slept for one hour. Nice. Oh, yeah, you can sleep to heal. Hey, buddy. What you need? Where are we? Whatever. None of this matters. The extra bed rolls. We, re on, on it, we really don't care about the plot. It's fine. It's fine. I was curious if we can figure out who that guy in our uh, other playthrough was. You recall? The guy with the pig leg? Uh, no, the... There was a guy, and he was, like, kind of a dipshit, and he... Um, but then, you know, he be, he's the big hero, because... Reasons. Oh. I don't remember it's that guy. not ring any bell. Nope. Uh, it was all the magic stuff, and we had to, like, meet him in, like, 16 different places over the course of the world. Oh, vaguely. Okay. It's probably fine. Yeah. But I'm like, who is that guy? I think he's part of the origin at some point. I just I have not met him. That's probably fine. Right. I don't remember him. He did not make an impression at the start. He did not make <laughs> much of an impression at the end. Uh, let's see. So the coolest thing about this game, I think, is the backpack system. So your backpack makes you scroll real bad, real slow, like you're heavy. But if you hit up on the D-pad, you just drop your backpack. That not only is that nice looking, it also has gameplay consequences, like you no longer have access to anything in your backpack because it's on the fucking ground. I don't like that. That is one of the, the, like, it's the best idea in this game, I think. 
even if it's not necessarily <laughs> the like sometimes it's annoying but it what that was so mean it's true but it's so mean what well, how can it be true and mean no uh, no no that was... <laughs> you were saying uh, okay should i find game uh, we have to go outside and do the, uh, hey, we did everything bad. A blood price is owed. If I don't see the money from you by the time I count to ten, you'll oh, oh boy. No, they're so loud. If you can Enough of to threat but only a You heard, mother. Away with you, or I- I'm so- If I could- That gives- Once you can make the payment, come see Long me. Long story short. Please find- Our- make We owe a blood debt because of something our parents did or something and it's ridiculous and we have only a few days to get enough money to pay off the blood debt or get uh like what, what would you call that getting um have you did they say it here there's a way to avoid the blood debt this is unacceptable what, what's the term for um, maybe she mentions it. It's like other ways to get a blood debt uh, repaid. A tribal favor. If we have a tribal favor, we could just ignore it. But we need to pay 150 silver. Uh, we don't get eggs. I don't think we get eggs up, but we lose our house. This house is really fucking important. It has our Resident Evil style chest. It's good. Because every other chest in the world like that are linked. These four months from this payment. Blah. Five days for 150 silver coins. Yeah, that's what you're already saying. Yeah. So now we're going to actually be synced up. I need to open the game. Uh, I think I'm just going to name it Lowercase Frosty. I think that's how that works. And you should be able to join. Okay. The game is it the same password as last time. No one else joined this, this super secret password no stream sniper fortunately it's only open to friends yeah oh okay well okay. so that helps a lot i mean other people on your friends list could be stream sniping. that's you true that's true think of all the consequences that could happen they did nice that. hair <laughs> thank I you i have a hat oh, wait wait very nice amazing right i look so good in my old age here we go that's let's hide that good. let's hide that hair Let's let, I'm gonna hide my hair too. <laughs> an old lady and an old lady. <laughs> oh, wait, we're, I'm gonna talk to Sword Lady because. Oh, she does she have something? Because that's the quest we're doing, right? Oh, was she the one you were referring to? No, oh, okay. she's not. Rufus commissioned it for me as a going away present. But with the shipwreck, it wouldn't. So be long story short. Soon. There are three paths in this game. There's the desert, the forest, and the Risa swamp. Has already promised We're doing and I will be having a long the swamp? Talk. We're doing monsoon this time? I think so. Yeah, Frosty? I would. Hmm? What's that? <laughs> We're doing <laughs> monsoon. The lore. <laughs> We're doing monsoon this time, right? Yes. Yes. Gotta do monsoon. Uh, swamp Town is we basically. Love... Yeah, go on. We love our, the organized religion. And it's like, God is real. We met him at the end of the previous. Like, it's gonna be good. You it's fine. Yeah. They didn't explain that when she's like, "I'm going on a holy mission." It's like, all right. Didn't explain that there's just you know some like thirty foot tall white rope figure. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, that's spoilers. Yeah. Don't worry about that. Don't what? Worry. There's no spoilers. I wouldn't spoil. You, no, no. That's just that, that's your uh, fan theory. Is that yeah. God is a God, like a hundred foot? Who you were because I'm used to you <laughs> being just a you? an extremely right. like out of place figure. <laughs> I looked. I I blended right in. <laughs> uh, I need to put this fucking torch away. Go. Okay, I have enough money to buy myself a mace, which I will do. Fun fact: two people can't talk to the same person at the same time unless you're doing skills. Why? I don't know. What? I don't know. I do. All right. Uh, can I buy a bow? Oh yeah, we should probably explain our builds. I'm going to try to do bows and not and daggers. And Frosty, you are doing. I'm doing mace and gun. I'm doing gun. maximum impact damage. I'm just gonna try and have like a bloodborne parry where I just stack so much impact damage that someone tries 
If, if I just need someone to lay off for a second, I just hit that button and they go flying. <laughs> that is the dream. That's the hope. We'll see if it can be realized. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't have the money to s truly sustain a bow build yet, but in time, it will get better. I mean, it's iron scrap and wood. It's not super hard to get. True. I, uh, I do need a pickaxe, though. Yeah, and um, we would go in the cave first, but we're going to walk out the front door so we get skills. Yeah. So a weird thing in this game is if you walk out the front door, if you're, whatever weapon you're holding in your hand, you get a skill for. And I don't know why. I don't know why it's like this that. This guy's standing there. Oh, does he teach us a skill? Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Oops, that, no. Whoa. I'm going outside. Like that, I need an equip weapon, a water skin. I don't have a water skin. If I let you invent you press to find a weapon. Make yourself a I'm also sure you can find a spare water skin. Um alright, I'll make sure. Farewell. Right, let's go get the, the water skin. I am pretty sure that it's not going to give us both the skin. <laughs> uh, oh, I thought you were gonna say both a water skin, because I think that's also true. That is also true, yes. Oh <laughs> God damn. Well, okay. So you talk to him, be like, I'm prepared, and then drop it and give it to me, and then I'll talk to him and say, I'm prepared. <laughs> uh, video. Actually, wait, no, if you talk to him, it might count your mace. I think your bow thing is more important. I don't know where the mace skill comes from. I don't know where the bow skill comes from. I think I the bow skin is in Monsoon, actually, because the hunter is there. Yes, actually. But that's a distance away. All of, the, all of the regions are a distance away. May I have a water skin, please? I'm actually pretty sure the maze skill is in this town. I don't know. Maybe. You could check the guy, the skill guy's over there. We haven't actually shown off the town yet, but we're... Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll go find the one guy who's just got one skill to teach. No, the axe skill is here. That's right. All right, I'm going to go buy a water skin, hopefully. Um, let me just let me just pop open a... Uh, hey, Chaz, how you tab. doing? Not that I would ever... Is there something you need? Oh, I can afford a water skin. Okay, Mason Fusion otherwise comes from Bird. Uh, is it going to keep telling me to put down my backpack whenever I roll? Yes, it is. Evasion Shot comes from also Bird. Okay. Hmm. So both the skills we want would be from Bird, so it, it's no difference who of us gets okay. it. Okay. Uh, if, if only one of us does. So, I'm oh. going to take it. <laughs> You're taking it? All right. Need something? We'll see if you can take it. I'm going at Well, you got the essentials at least. Here. Okay. I'll teach, I'll teach you a skill. skill. Well, the one you're currently I'm holding. The weapon I'm currently holding. Yes. There you go. I sure learned your mason fusion. He just he just handed me a skill. Thanks, bud. Did you get one? Or when you want to head out? Hmm? Did you get one? Oh no. Okay. Let's find out. Something. It did not pop up with anything. I did not Need learn something? my mason fusion. <laughs> I'm super glad we did it in that order. It's fine. I'm, I'm leave. Oh wait, no. We don't actually have to go outside. We can, we can go the other way now. Yeah, now we can just. We, go we just wasted that entire, oh, entire thing. That's fine. Well, no one could have predicted. That. <laughs> Good God, why would it? Why? This game is well built. I mean, I could go back in my single player game, and nothing Dude. carries over. So I could go grab my. You, you could if you really want to. I'm gonna go get the bow skill just to spite. <laughs> Uh, just makes sense. So in general, it looks like we're just skipping by a ton of content. Like, there are some items here and there, like these crafting recipes over here. Most of these doors and buildings are completely fake. Almost, like, 90% of them aren't real. You cannot use them, you cannot go into them. There's no one to like talk to. NPCs in this town. Yeah. That are named, and four of them are shops. Most of these people are either guards that just tell you where things are, or just don't talk to you. Uh, it is a very hollow world. Amber, my friend. I can Amber, teach you. My friend. Uh, I do think the skill system is interesting. You have three uh, chain breaks in the entire game. You can never get more. You can never respec. You go from bottom to top. If you want to get any of the top uh, abilities, you have to chain break and purchase the middle, and then you can take anything above it. Uh, and you have to pay for those too, but you know. Um, so it's neat. So you have to re you. You don't get to pick a class, you build out a class. Yeah, I, I kind of like that. It's also, though, hard to make informed decisions sometimes without the wiki and, like, the number of skills that there actually are. Yeah. Like, 
like there are in the base game there is one kind of skill per each weapon uh, it's not much in with the dlc there is two <laughs> It's also a game that seems incredibly hard solo. Because enemies don't give a shit about, like, spacing or giving you air. Yeah, I, I have no idea how that works. Especially once you get surrounded. But even some single enemies are just, like... Extremely aggressive. ...a finite amount of stamina. So yeah. you can dodge and block and, and hit all you want. But at a certain point, the stamina you have and the stamina it takes to win are, uh, are going to clash and you're going to have a bad time. And yeah, well, I think this is a good game. It's just really jank and has a lot of problems that you can't help but be like, why couldn't you just fix these little little problems here and there? Especially when it comes to multiplayer, where the second player will never get um, any of the abilities or skills or rewards for any of the quests. It's like, really? You couldn't have uh, been a, done another pass on that? Like, the fact that this game is mostly only playable in co-op... There's your mining pick. Uh, Hooray. Oh, right. This, this I can't backpack see. does not work as a... Uh... It does not. We have to get better backpacks. Yeah, okay. And then one is Vita. Yeah, there we go. All right. How does bow work? Not like that. Not I will like... say the bow thing, it's interesting. It is a... I didn't get to use it very much because my previous character had all of their stamina uh, destroyed um, by an, an incident. Uh, <laughs> but... It was a horrible max man, uh, mana accident. Don't worry about it. There was a there was a small issue. I think ranged is going to be extremely powerful as long as I have the ammo. Because you know their AI is not great. We did it. it really is. Oh hey, he had three arrows in him and wood. For more arrows. I'm gonna let you be the torchbearer. Like this would benefit from restrictions oh. in like, it, it's too open. There's too much scope and there's too much like, I don't know, just, just jank. Uh, yeah. I express what I'm saying. The the, the, way, the problem is that the world is bigger than the amount of content they had. I need to. Yeah. That's fine. Wait. You okay? What? Right now, you are <laughs> you are holding your bow fully drawn, except there isn't a bow. There's a lantern. <laughs> tilted at 45 degrees. Amazing. That's how I shoot my arrows. It's fine. Yeah. This um, is how you get fire arrows, okay? We should probably do the beach now before we fuck up that side quest. Yeah. So there's a lot of timers in this game that the game doesn't let you know about. Especially this first one, where if we don't go to the beach now, wish someone will fucking die forever. And if we let them die, we have to pay back the blood price, the blood debt, and that's no good. Wait, we get an additional blood debt if they die, or... We don't get to... just don't get the free tribal thing. We don't get the free voucher for one free blood debt. I mean, I'm honestly interested what the mechanic... like. This is the way we went on on the, my first run of this game, and it's like, okay, here's the narrative tension of you have five days to make up this uh, amount of money. Mm -hmm. And it's like, okay, this is something. I, I, I see the amount of money of everything in my house, and it's like 25 gold. It's like, okay, I understand the narrative stakes. I understand the challenge before me. And then I walk out of the first dungeon, and there's a guy who's like, hey, I'm going to solve the whole thing. You could have, have to, to be about anything. To be fair, let's say it's a 50-50 chance we walk this way. Also, if we don't kill that fucking big, big shrimp, uh, we won't notice him, and we might just die here. But he is right here, so let's just Hello. chat. I can't. Uh, I can't move. Do you have any healing items? Oh, I, I need a Hurry. bandage or something. Oh. I don't know how long I have. See narrative stakes. Bandage. How do we make bandages again? We need linen. Tatter cloth. I gave it to him. Oh, nice. You did it. it working. That's all he needed. Just a regular bandage. Oh, yeah. Dragon's Dogma, too. Fuck yeah. Oh, oh yeah. We did it. I don't think I'm fit to run back home just yet. Uh, that shrimp is looking at us a little bit. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. He's looking at you. Hold up. I hit the wrong button. Ow. Oh, don't die. Oh, God. oh that's because that was the sprint button. And you should probably drop your backpack, too. I've been playing Elden Ring and I've forgotten how to. 
Aggro is damage based, by the way, so in a weird way. For example, if Frosty were to light this thing on fire, fire does damage ticking. Every tick of damage basically reorients the aggro back onto Frosty. Which is weird and really frustrating if I'm trying to draw aggro, but she has a fire weapon. And it's just yeah. it's just weird. No matter how much damage I do, it keeps looking at her again. Also, you are uh, really getting its attention right now. There we go. I mean, that actually is going to be good for... We figured that out eventually, and I started using like lightning stuff, and you started using fire. Yeah, once we understood what was going on, it was a lot better. That motherfucker shot me backwards. Good game. Good video game. Thank you. <laughs> I just, the more I look at this game, the more I'm like, if they put this on a grid, the jank shit wouldn't happen because it's on a grid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you want to make a grid outward. A grid-based <laughs> outward. It's the weirdest fucking thing in the world. <laughs> Oh, by the way, this entire stream is just going to be like two and a half hours of me pitching different versions of that. Um, <laughs> Let me eat some bread to heal. <laughs> I've been making the same game for too long, and now it's, yeah. Now, now this, you're. This is my life is just, I could make this better. I could do something else. I could do anything else, but the <laughs> thing I'm doing. Hey, you're moving along with that game. I am. It's getting places. Um, I have a bunch of troglodyte spears and stuff. Do we want to check out this? I don't think this uh, yeah, cave... I don't think we can go in here right now because of the time of day. Oh, uh, we'll, we'll find out. I don't yeah. know if it's a day or a night thing. I, I feel like it's probably a night thing. I think it's a night thing. That's also, fine. the day-night cycle does not do much. Which, it would make more sense for the day-night thing to do something in this game than in Elden Ring. Yeah. And Elden Ring is the one that's like... Hey, what if we just put a bunch of no. bosses and shit everywhere? No, walk away. Yeah. It's flooded. Yeah, I don't... I don't mind there being secrets. The Elden Ring thing was just, like, obnoxious to find them. And, I don't know, I guess they're building a game that is designed for a community, not a single person. <laughs> Which is, if they want to do that, that's fine. Uh, with this game, though, you'd expect brigands to be on the roads more around dusk and night. Or something. Yeah. Or maybe there's more monsters around at night, or... So like, pick a theme, but it's, yeah, exactly. it's just random. Um, oh, shit. We should see if there's blue sand. You will want blue oh, sand. Yeah. That's really important. And unfortunately, it is in pretty much invisible during the day. Yeah. Let's see. If I angle my camera real low. I mean, I what we could do is rest until... Oh, hey, there's Amalite. Oh, let me grab that. Uh, we could rest until morning and then... Or rest until night. Ah, sure, why not? We have go we in have the some... cave, which also has sand, and then get scoured. Oh, you know what? Okay, sand. let's do it. Yeah, we got. I've got Just a little bit of nice. water. You know how people uh, like to sleep on the sand on a beach. Yeah, it's good. It's right on it. The tides don't move mm -hmm. famously. Oceans are actually very still. It's because they're full. Famously, all the sand on the beach is not there because water was there at any point. Um, that's what keeps the water away. So if you're on sand, no water will ever touch it. <laughs> it's repellent. It's water repellent, yeah. Mm -hmm. I do like some of the survival stuff, like the camping out and the get chance of getting attacked and all that kind of stuff. Is it dark enough? I don't know. We can do the camp. Oh, no, thing. wait. See it? Do I see it? might see it no let's sleep a couple more hours okay there should be there should definitely be some right now yeah and i'm pretty sure that cave works at like just after dusk i can't rest this far away from you Dan. well really interesting we've never tried to do that before i've never seen that mechanic before yeah normally we just naturally you know get near because obviously we, we want to prepare for ambushes for warmth for, well, yes for warmth <laughs> Um, let's do like here. Yeah. yeah. Um, and the ambush mechanic also makes zero sense because how are you protecting yourself while you're asleep? Because you're not on watch. You're just well, no. If awake. you're on watch twenty percent of the time, then you're a hundred percent safe. I'm gonna just oh, run down. Problem. I'm just gonna run this way. I'm gonna run the other way. 
also gotta drink water because I'm dying. Uh, being low on food or water does fuck up your stamina like real bad. Eating some bread. I see some blue sand. Nice. So it is out. I think I see a merchant. Or is that a is that a shrimp? Oh my god, I think that's a merchant over here. I've never seen him over here before. No, no, that's a shrimp. <laughs> he was just so still. It looked like a lantern. He's like that fish that lures you in. Oh, an anglerfish? Yeah. Angler shrimp. I'm just watching someone who's doing a, a like a let's play of Soma. And they just got to the anglerfish part of that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's pretty spooky. It's so good. Anytime there's an anglerfish in a game, that's some spooky shit. Uh, so for reference, oh god. I'm not fighting him. Um, blue sand is used to make a really good starter set. Uh, it will take actual days in-game to finish, but it is really, really worth it. And I was honestly wearing it for most of the game. It took until like late game for me to actually start switching out pizzas. Yeah, Soma's really great. Love so like, Soma changed the way I, like... It's just such a good um, transhumanist story. And I always, I love the WoW so much. Like, it's it's a bad villain. It's a bad thing. You're supposed to not like it. I was the one who's like, no, nah, actually, I'm going to not kill the WoW, even if you tell me to. And mm -hmm. then, uh, like, the teleporting monster is like, hey, no, you're supposed to kill this thing. And I'm like, still no, though. <laughs> <laughs> I think it got ate by a giant anglerfish, and then, you know. I got the, the ending where it continues and will someday maybe colonize the surface of the world in a weird... Oh, wait, there's of... multiple endings? I, no, but, like, that is one of the only booleans in terms of, like, what things can or can't happen. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, hey, there so you are. it's like, uh, whether you kill um, whatever the character name is, uh, the here. second one. <clears throat> uh, you take... Because you're going to be the one using this armor, yeah, so here's the true. sand... And you know what? I'm going to drop this for you, too. Ooh, okay. okay. All right, let's check out that du uh, dungeon. Yes, that, that cave. Yes. Oh, right. LL gets stuck forever. <laughs> wow, that is... <laughs> Very spooky. That's a spooky shark right there. But yeah, there's a couple of different, like... It's all the same endings, because the story isn't about, like, that other shit going on. Mm-hmm. There's a couple different endings, or, or there, there is not different endings, but there are different variables. There's different choices, and to me, those magic is like okay, someday, Earth is going to be populated by a bunch of goopy, weird robots, <laughs> all with the same like thirteen personalities, and I could <laughs> write a fan fiction about that, without trying very hard. Um, is that more? But yeah, sand? that's that's a bit further up. Yeah, that, I mean. It's really interesting. I, I, it would have been neat if they had full alternate endings, but the game's also quite old at this point. Yeah. I mean, the alternate endings wouldn't really, like, they have the ending and they have the, the like, fake-out ending. It's a part. Um, which are just really fantastically done. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, the... Um, That's I, true. I don't think you need to see the whole scope of everything else. For yeah, that's, that's what LL is saying. Experience. And some questions are... Not answering questions is almost the point. Yeah, exactly. Hey, there we go. Hey, look, it's a cave. Hey, look, there's a shrimp. So you're supposed to come here during a plot point. That's why we know how to actually access this cave. Because otherwise it's full during most times of the day. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happens if we're inside when it fills up. I'm assuming it just doesn't. I'm assuming it does. Like, they don't have the technology to actually Ooh. change it. It's just... If you load the area, you, you want that halberd. Uh, I'm going to take the other stuff just to sell it because we broke. Yeah, fair enough. We don't need no mana stones. No, that blue sand, though. Blue sand. Oh, there's more. I'm just going to help you. So. There's actually quite a lot oh, on the yeah. beach and here. Here's more for you. I think it's five for the armor and five is typically good. Uh, there's a I've got nine right now. Damn, like. Incoming. Oh, did I? 
Did not hit. I oh it didn't. Okay, on my nope, screen it hit you because I dodged out of the way. But it's like impossible to know what's actually going on in this game. Why doesn't he care about you? God, we're weak bitches. God, the impact damage. It's literally just it, filling up faster than I can hit. Yeah, we, we basically just don't do any. Also, did you see that? He, the enemies will dodge someone attacking them even when they're not focused on them, which is really strange. There's a lot of this that's really strange. Why is he only mad at me? I didn't even hit him yet. Wow, you're kicking his ass. I mean, slowly. Just go for it. Just fucking go. There we go. And sometimes they just do that. Um, is this one mine? This one's mine. Oh yeah, they're the same. We don't know. Uh, I won't bother talking about how the backpacks can disappear and do all sorts of weird shit because it'll happen and we'll talk about it then. <laughs> yeah. I mean, in whole though, we never permanently lost the backpack. That's true, but we did get real spooked. We got real scared. Uh, I'm gonna. This is clean yeah, water, by the way. When it happens, it'll happen. And it will happen. It will happen. Is there nothing back here? Just a shrimp? Uh, I think this is where you talk to the guy and he's like, Yep. Oh, um, yeah. My granddad's old watch. And it's like, then why are we here? Um, why did you invite us on this adventure if you already found the... Th if you're going to find the thing the moment we get here? I just want to... I thought there might be amylite or something, but I guess not. Amylite's another good ingredient for crafting. Okay, I guess that's that. There is salt. I can't. don't have a pick, though. Oh, is there? Let me grab it. Yeah. I don't know why I equipped the pickaxe to do this. <laughs> Actually, the pickaxe is more damage than the uh, the machete. Do you want the pickaxe? Uh, no, because I want my other hand free. Because I okay. don't have a bag. Yeah, we we broke. We I broke. actually, one thing this game does do well is the progression of you're literally wearing like rags and you have what pretends to be a backpack, and you just evolve from there. <clears throat> And even the backpack gets fancier and can start to hold stuff for you. Mm -hmm. Nothing stays the same from the end, or from the start to the end. Like mm. Every piece of equipment you will upgrade. Your bedroll is going to get better. Oh yeah, the bedroll goes through multiple iterations. Yeah, and I appreciate that sort of thing. But there's a good amount of progression. There's value to discovering shit. Uh, at a certain point, though, I mean, it can be hard with certain... Items like, okay, here's a shield. How many different ways can you take a shield? Like, I don't take Breath it that of the Wild couldn't figure out much to do. Like, this game does shields better than Breath of the Wild. I don't know if Tears of the Kingdom ever did it better, but. Um. Does this game do it better? I mean, they have I mean, some at special least effects. A status effect on it, right? Yeah, but you can't ride your shield down a cliff. Okay, but like the different shields, <laughs> right? Uh, okay, on that very specific point, I, I would agree. This game is better than Breath of the Wild. You heard it Confirmed. Uh, you want that armor. I want that tea. For reasons, yeah. basically. Not good reasons, I just want it. Uh, this game is obsessed with tea. Uh, tea solves a lot of problems. To the point of it can restore... Keep it in a loose bag, you... Oh, and don't dogs. Questions. Oh, you got glowing eyes, my friend. Okay, why are they all only mad at me? Wait, how do you put this block? Blocking is extremely overpowered in this game. Uh, enemies abuse it like crazy. We can abuse it not as effectively because we care about our lives. Do we have a stamina bar? Yeah, the enemies don't have stamina bars. They have block bars, but they don't care, and they'll just... It's frustrating. It'll, it'll be more apparent with humanoid enemies. Oh, thank you. You're here. I haven't been using my kick. This is the. Oh shit! You're right. There is a kick. Is yours not auto equipped? It is. I forgot about it though. <laughs> I got a disease. Good. Good job. Thank you me. did it. You came out here to get new experiences or something, and already you found one. Yeah. This is. This is the uh, adventure simulator where you go out and get mauled by a hyena and then die slowly of an infection <laughs> while they take your house away. <laughs> <laughs> this is when people say they want more realism in their games. That's what they mean, right? Yep. 
is like you are super not the protagonist. You you beat the hyena, yeah, but at what cost? Now you got you got bit somewhere. Ah. That skin over there is not going to be the. This is what I was looking for. Fingers now, it's just like permanent scars every fight. (laughs) Oh Uh, god, you know what? This game doesn't do permanent injuries somehow. Arrows, power coil. We need. Oh, we we need. We need two or one. We need at least one. So keep that with you forever now. Yeah. Uh, the fact that it says it in plural really confuses the whole thing. Because do we need power coils or do we need power coils? Plural. Yeah. I don't know. But we'll keep it for a long time. Mm-hmm. Uh, actually, we do know where to use that. I know where yeah, to we use do. It. Yeah. It's pretty close by, but we should probably. Let the town start commissioning people for their armor, even though it costs yeah. more than our entire blood debt. Yeah, but we don't all have a blood debt anymore. We have a voucher. Oh, that's right. <laughs> we got a voucher. We got one free uh, four months of blood debt. Pay. We got all five punches on our punch card, and we are good to go. <laughs> no, you're a stump. I thought this was a person. <laughs> it was a stump with some twigs next to it. Uh, I do care my bag is overweight. I also really want to get money. So for the moment, I'm going to suffer. Uh, oh, ho- yeah, my bag is super not overweight. but Hopefully I can get some enough money to buy a better bag, which will drastically oh. improve our situation. This is like a Majora's Mask when you, you know, put enough money into the bank, you get the bigger rupee pouch. Mm-hmm. What a stupid That's- fucking mechanic. <laughs> I mean, okay, also, this is the bank that remembers, like, like, you show up there with a piece of paper to a woman you've never seen before, and you're like, yeah, my bank account has 5,000 rupees in it. You don't know about it because it happened, you know, in the like, future in past. Timeline. Uh, and she goes, yeah, sure, here's 5,000 rupees. Greetings, friend. She's not smart. Oh, you don't No, not, not especially. Oh, God, I have no stamina. Uh, so, now that there's enough burnt stamina on my bar, using stamina slowly burns your stamina. You have to either eat a special item or sleep to get that stamina back. Otherwise, it's just burned forever. You can never burn more than three quarters of your bar, uh, but it can still be quite debilitating. Also, health works the same way. The more you get hit, the more health you burn. What can I do? Uh, it can be rough. Right. It's a neat. It's kind of a neat mechanic. It's encouraging you to sleep. I'm glad you survived the wreck. Wait, no, Rufus, I've already talked to you about your glowing sword. Oh, fuck. We need this. I have a tiny aquamarine. We're gonna have to keep that for a little bit. Yeah, I think so. Already promised me that I would. Oh hey, I can sell the writ of tribal favor for forty-five silver. Wow. Oh boy. And then you can pay that forty-five silver to pay, you know, like blood debt. Thirty percent of the blood debt. <laughs> um. Do, wait. Does that mean we can buy, technically buy it from someone? I don't know if we can, but I'm gonna go talk to the lady right now and be like, hey, don't take our fucking house. The idea, though, of having a writ of tribal favor and then, like, going to some random person and being like, yeah, I'm going to sell this to you. And that person goes and, like, goes up to Risa and says, hey, I got it. I got this. I definitely saved that guy on the beach. No one will figure out my my deception. Definitely not the guy on the beach. Why don't we auction this sort of thing? Why don't we auction this off? Like, couldn't we get a couldn't we get a bunch of money? Well, apparently they're going to take the house to settle the 150 silver debt. Mm. So actually, that means the house is pretty cheap. Yeah, like I mean, long term. It's pretty cheap when we buy it in the other place. Just we're not allowed to buy. Ah, it. Ah, that's true. Debt, I I think she's up here. I'm not sure. I'm just taking everything I can get my hands on as I walk around. Oh yeah, yeah I found her. Greetings. I want to talk about my blood price? I earned a tribal favor. And on time too. She's so happy. Well, Oli we did it. And Izan are leaving Cierzo. Okay, so we finished the main first quest. Now everyone, there are three main people in the city, and they're going to each of the main quest lines. They're the out of here. Leaving to go join the holy. <gasps> A blood price has. Also, none of our question questions or answers matter to any of these said your dialogue boxes. They just don't matter. Sometimes they matter. Like, if you don't give that one guy in that one quest enough positive encouragement in the 14 places you talk to him, <laughs> um, he th- there are, like, six different endings to that quest. Huh. Yeah, it's weird. Are we gonna do that? No. Oh, okay. Well, thanks, <laughs> but some of these, maybe there's a quest like that for Monsoon. May- Who knows? Maybe. Wait, these are my... 
These are the pale white cloak? Oh, I, okay, I see it. I don't want to wear this. I'm gonna sell it. I just robbed the uh, the cheapest or whatever her deal is. What what is her title? Oh, oh hey this okay this lady with the glowing sword. She's like oh yeah I talked to my mom and she's done some fucked up things in the past. <laughs> and it's like we know that because we did her storyline. This is true. That is true. What did she do specifically? I've kind of forgotten. Um, I believe. Uh, spoilers. <gasps> Um, there is a, a evil red lich who lives on the moon, um, and that evil red lich loves to just make babies, uh, and this, because that's is where her power comes from, is as long as she has descendants on Earth, she's immortal. Uh, and this, uh, Risa has been hunting them down and killing them one by one. Mm. Uh, these, these babies are not much gain, but the only one of them we meet is also evil, so... Really, it's, you know, it's fine. Uh, would you like a, a hatchet or a felling great axe, by chance? I don't think so. You don't want either of them? Okay, well, I'll sell them. I'll, yeah. I'll do it. Actually, I might keep the axe for myself. Does it do more impact? Barely. Other. It's all bad. Um, fuck it. Fuck it. Okay. So we are uh, one blue sand short and about a thousand silver short. <laughs> a thousand silver? Oh no! Yeah. Oh, I forgot it was expensive. All right. Um, would you like a backpack? I would love a backpack. You got backpack money? I got backpack. I've been selling a lot. I've been going everywhere, slurping everything up. <laughs> Here is your backpack. I don't know where you are, so hopefully you find me. So you have to put your backpack on the ground. You open it. Oh, wait, no. Oh, God. Sorry. I equip the new backpack, and then I look at my old backpack, and then I take everything, including it. And then I walk up to this person, and they say... Something you need? I won't accept that... Oh, wait, no, they do take it. Oh, shit. For some reason, I thought they wouldn't. And then he saw your old one, yeah. For some reason I thought they wouldn't take it. If he equip this new backpack, then I go open, we'll, take all. We'll get into it later. Again. But I do yeah. kind of like the way elements work in this game, where they actually matter. Is, uh, something which is something Dark Souls has been afraid of for quite some time. Yeah, no kidding. Oh. And now our backpack has... Lanterns, which are actually our lanterns that are uh, in our backpacks. So you can now equip them to the backpack. That means you can have both hands free. It's super nice. <laughs> Things like this, great. Love it. But then it's also where you place your backpack is now important if you're fighting in a dark cave. Like that's True, yeah, because you can light it and then drop it. And now it is your area, your zone of sight. <laughs> in a pitch dark cave. Yeah, it's it's a neat system. It would matter more if the darkness was darker. It can be kind of dark. I've had trouble before. Depending. There have been times where I'm like holding a torch and it's still too dark, so I just turn the brightness up, and now, now then it doesn't matter. Dark. But that's I guess that's an issue with like every game, right? If you can just yeah. change the brightness. I mean, there are games where they just sort of, and it doesn't happen in 3D as much, but they basically just, you know. Put a black area mm. outside of the sphere is darkness. You should grab some water if you haven't. Oh yeah. Uh, money also takes weight, which is why you will eventually want to buy gold bars, which are lighter, for some reason. It's fine. You want to go well, kill some uh... a very tiny gold bar? <laughs> it's a gold slipper, really. Mm -hmm. Do you want to go kill some bandits and maybe get you a really cool backpack? Yes, I do. Let's go. I got a hatchet. All right. I got a mace still. I'm su I'm supposed to be. Oh wait, do I have enough? I'm gonna buy as many arrows as I can buy, and then I will be ready to kill. <clears throat> what could oh I yeah, you rest? could be using the dagger around now. Oh, can I? Oh no, wait. It's. Do we have a sh much? Do we have a shitty one. 
Can we make a shitty one? Like the rondel dagger, I think. That's t the the oh, broad dagger is 200. Make a shiv with the scrap or something. Having a regular shiv wouldn't be bad. Um, I just don't know how to make one. Don't know how to make a shiv. God. I know. I shouldn't even be out in the world. All right. It might literally just be a piece of wood and an iron scrap. I don't know. That sounds right to me, but... Uh, it, it does sound pretty... <laughs> Wait, no. Bag. Okay. Time to quick slot this one. One second. Nope, nope. Come on. There we go. Now, hopefully this game won't soft lock on us. <laughs> like another game did. <laughs> game that will not be mentioned. No, that, that won't happen. Listen, this is a jank game, but it's not a can't-do-load-screens jank game. It's everything between the load screens jank. Oops. I'm just practicing yeah, switching weapons. I opened up a map to, to show it. To oh, yeah. That's um right on the D-pad. Look at this Obviously, map. Obviously, I, I know what D-pad button it would be. Oh, yeah, you're on mouse and keyboard because you're a psycho. <laughs> yep. I literally tried Elden Ring on mouse and keyboard or on a controller, like, last night, and I was like, okay, no, this, I can't do it. <laughs> Triangle to interact with things? What are you talking about? Yeah. I have to take my hand off of the movement trigger if I want to use one of my quick items? That's not a quick item anymore, that's a Wait, the movement trigger? What are you talking about? The movement, uh, joystick. Like the left, the left joystick? Yeah. Why, why would you have... But why not use your right you thumb? Quick... What? what are you talking about quick swapping? Uh, not to, yeah, to change between, or to use a quick item, right? I thought that was, oh god, now I can't remember. Sorry, it, it's, it, it is trying, hold down triangle and then left thumb, right? But it means you need to take your thumb off of the thumbstick where you, that you Oh yeah, but it's just like a quick, it's a really quick thing. You any, know, any. I shouldn't have to take my thumb off of the, the walk button. Anyway, I never have to take my fingers off the wazgas. Uh, this map has no player marker, so you kind of interestingly, you have to figure out where you are by your surroundings. So, fortunately for this map, <laughs> did you just get fucked up by that? No. Uh, there's a giant magic mountain in the fucking center. Uh, Conflux Mountain. We're going to be going in there at some point, maybe tonight. Okay, uh, ran away. And we know where Sierra is, so we're like right here-ish. Uh, and then there's all these big landmarks, and then there's also many, many caves and dungeons we can explore and find on our way from. I'm just realizing my health is quite bad. Yeah, you're doing not good. You wanna? Yeah. You wanna sleep? It or wouldn't something? be a bad idea to sleep inside. Get free. Oh, food. oh, you know what? Free food. You're right. Yeah. Uh, something we discovered much later in our playthrough than we should have is that if you sleep in a home, you get fed and watered. Like a plant. Mm -hmm. There's just natural to any home. There's just sort of some old lady who lives under the floorboards, and so every time you sleep there, it's just there with like a, a nice soup or something. But make sure you never look at her. You shouldn't. Don't look, look at directly her. at the, the old lady. It's no, considered that's a boss fight you can't win. And we'll probably introduce super speed on our way back from the bandits. Yeah. We'll be like, hey, this is how we're going to play most of this game. Because fuck the actual travel time. It, it The game does not respect your time. No, it doesn't. It really doesn't. It would be one thing if it was, you know, fast travel enabled once you got there. Or uh, you just went a different a direction you were under the stairs <laughs> don't worry person. about that um oh it doesn't think i can sleep one second let me also undo and redo can there you sleep go. nope nope it, it started to think i could and then it could. It i'm going to you are far beneath your bed all right have i corrected um or i'm gonna leave the room you i'm gonna leave i've come back in I am walking gently, trotting maybe. Am I good? Yep, yep. Okay, <laughs> you're good. Perfect game. Uh, Very similar to the ladders, right? Yeah. 
Right. Let's, yeah, that, this should be fine. So yeah, in order for Frosty to heal and return burnt mana, she has to sleep. Now, the funny thing is, with magic, if you sleep, you burn mana. So sleeping is not always a good. Yeah. So, like, if you're a mage, not only do you lose out on stamina and health, but also Permanently. you are less inclined to get those things back through sleep because you lose mana. Now, granted, even on my most mana-hungry <laughs> versions of that character... I did not ever use any mana, pretty much. Yeah. Honestly, only two, um... Well, we'll show it off more later, but only two interactions is probably more than you need. <laughs> oh, I forgot. We should have also remembered. Uh, sleeping gives us, in this place, cold defense and stamina reduction by 20%. Which is, yeah. like, really good. Because everything you do costs so much fucking stamina. Hey, pal, you're going to teach something else. I want to train with you. Okay, no. I can teach you a two-handed sword technique. Oh, boy. Um, There are a lot of skills we want to learn in the starting town, even if we're not going to chain break. But, like, costs a lot of them. Yeah. We're, we broke. Also, the game not uh, respecting your time thing. You want to run because it's faster. But if you run, you can already see that I've burned a tiny bit of stamina, like already. So it's like, oh no, you want the game wants you to slowly walk. But if you're walking slowly, you're also going to need to eat more over. Oh, you can't see my stamina. Ah, shit, it's there. Don't worry about it. I forgot about that. I should probably change my setup at some point. <laughs> so many important things at the bottom left corner of the fucking screen. Just put your stuff right in the dead center. Dead oh yeah, put my camera in the dead center. Perfect. Just have it at a low of <laughs> the whole screen. Uh, let's deal with the bandits first. Yeah. I probably shouldn't have even bought you a backpack. It's fine. This could go very badly. So. That chicken wants some. The chicken on my ass? It's on your ass. Ow. That did a quarter of my health. It did a quarter of my health. Our armor sucks because we don't have any. Oh, yeah, that would do it. I've stolen its egg. Egg. The most delicious of meals. Oh, hey, that's a Wendigo. Let's not touch that. Yeah, let's just hug the right. <laughs> we can't win that fight right now. Nope. So the game feels pretty vibrant at first, and then you start to notice things like they're just dropping random enemies in places. And you're like, oh, there's actually no lore. This is or... the... Careful. As close to a snowy area. Careful, 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 careful. I forgot. Yep. You're bleeding. I can see your blood all over the place. Yeah. So there's traps in this game. I don't have any band-aids. Um, I don't also... Have I don't. We haven't killed any... Let's go kill some bandits. Yeah. Their bandages are made of bandits. Pretty That's where much. The names are similar. They share a common root word. Uh, if you, I mean, if you die right now, you're gonna, you're probably gonna die in like two seconds. Don't even, bo don't even bother. I'm just eating. We know, we both know you're about to face plant. Unless there's maybe one of these is a, a hollowed out trunk. I don't think uh, that's gonna save me. <laughs> oh no, Frosty! So, this game actually has really good co-op mechanics. You just pick your friend back up, and you're good. Except I have 60% uh, burned health. Well, you should have remembered about the trap. And yeah, they are on the uh, both side, or on one side of the bridge, because the bandits would always hit them if they had to, like, think about it, is my assumption. I don't think we can kill the boss of this, but we can try. <laughs> Yeah. Um, if he hits one of us, we're probably just going to explode. Dude, also, the... These aren't bandits. This is the Montcalm clan who ah, to yeah, murder sure. people so that they can serve their ghost ancestors. Uh, you have the power cell, right? Go ahead, look, dude. The power cell? The power cell. Oh, yes. Ow. Did that, that fucking hit me, really? Uh, B, you are uh, surrounded. There's a dog. A little bit. Just block. Just block. 
So I'm pretty sure if there are iframes in this game, they're very low. Dog. Dog. Hey, give me a second. Oh god, he turned. You have a pistol? Where the fuck did you get a pistol? This is the third time I've shot my gun. I haven't even seen it. I noticed. <laughs> I did good damage. They really want me. It's also the only, the last bullet I had. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Okay, now I need a fucking bandage. I did not have one. I like that I get a lot of arrows back from their corpses. Yeah. That's shocking, actually. Oh no, I picked up the iron scrap oh, or something. No, no I, I didn't. Oh, okay. It's all good. How oh, dare even begin to think that's for you. Uh, I'm just gonna eat. Um, how long am I bleeding for? Is it? It's not actually infinite, is it? I believe it might be. It might actually be infinite. I need to kill another. I need to kill a man and steal a piece of cloth. Yes, this is the only way. We can't use anything. Well, actually, you can deconstruct your armor. I believe. Oh, that's this true. Not something I've ever engaged with. Uh, is there someone in here? There is someone. I should have dropped my backpack. Okay. I'm gonna drop my backpack right now. Oof. That one's got me. Like, the bow's pretty strong against unarmored targets, anyway. Oh, he, he got me. There we go. I got him. Just now. Yeah. This is where... Alright, get your prize. We need a power cell to open this door. Uh, two Do you need two? Cells. Ah, shit. It is you should at least add one. I can't. Oh, you can't? Oh, okay. I could drop it on the ground. Ooh, a good Ooh, lantern. Good lantern. No, I wouldn't trust this place to actually keep data. Oh. Well, that is a lot brighter. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to kill people until I, uh... Get a bandage or I'm dead. Here, let me pull. <laughs> We're kiting now. Let me just taunt him. I missed. Just don't die. I need you to not be down. Oh. There we go. Look at that teamwork. <laughs> You're fine. I laid Look, on the see? ground and you shoot them. Yeah. This is very similar to our previous run where I laid on the ground and you killed them. <laughs> it's it's fine. Okay. I've got padded boots. I'm gonna take my old boots and I'm going to Can you grab that weapon? I can't carry too much more. Oh yeah. Actually no, I'm lying, I can carry a lot. There is a way to uh, what is it? You just put the boots in and you get linen cloth. One cloth for the pair of boots. Okay. Uh, Shrek, Not showing, you. showing people this game is honestly pretty entertaining for me. Because this game is just like... It's just a special mixture of jank. So if you just take any random piece of equipment and craft it, it will turn into a linen cloth. Like I did that with boots. Oh. But it was one cloth. So. That guy's a bow. Yeah, he does. Uh, he, he is having trouble. <laughs> He's just a kid. Oh, they both have bows, apparently. No ammunition. What? Excuse me, sir. Oh, did he get gotcha. He got me. I've been got. My health is all burnt, and I <laughs> need to recognize that. <laughs> You're not as strong as you once were. Actually, technically, you should have more health than your previous character. I think I got some health ups from various skill breaks and abilities, so I think that's not true. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Shoot, Jesus Christ. Oh. Well, their aim isn't very good. What? Just dodging. Just dodging. It's fine. <laughs> AI. Amazing. Come on, man. An archer, you got bread. 
Uh, yeah, take that. I missed a lot, but fortunately, arrows apparently just stay forever, so I can just pick them back up. Ooh, that guy had a lot of arrows. Shrek, you know who you're talking about, right? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, now it's all now it's all happening. You found. Oh, hey, a cooking I pot. found five bullets and a hat. Ooh. Now we're talking. I'm gonna turn my old hat into bandages. Thank you. I'm still bleeding out. Is that you? I That's can make you. one bandages. Thank you. I offer you one bandage. It's funny. At a certain point in the game, you actually can't stop having too many bandages on your person, so this is kind of a weird situation we're in right now. Normally, they just want to drop linen cloth. Yeah, right? Wait, is that a shiv? No, that's a torch. I do want a shiv. There's a guy in this building. Is he friendly? <laughs> no. You want me to shoot him? You sh you sh oh my god, that does so much damage. Oh no. Yeah, I mean, the reload time is the problem, right? Right, but if you have time to hang out for a second while it's, like, yeah. aggro's on me, that's some good good damage. Let me pick up the... Boink. The halberd. I just got a... Ooh, a chest. Uh, or a backpack jangling full of halberd. Ooh, that's for you. I want at least one meal... Um, take everything, fuck it. Right. I should technically not... Why does it say I need another bandage? Am I that fucked up? Uh, I think that's just telling us how to craft. Oh. Actually, I don't know why that exists. Is, I don't know what that is. is. I don't know that what that symbol is? I don't know. Huh. Does not make any sense. That was very confusing then. I don't think I've been injured this entire time. Got another I chest. I think you were surviving the bleeding for quite a while. Yeah, I'm like, huh, I don't remember it being this, uh, you know, lenient, but, you know, what? I, I see the symbol, so the symbol must be not lying to me, right? Why would the symbol lie? Well, why would it show you a bandage if you're bleeding? Obviously, it would show you a, a red circle with a blood drop in it. Yeah, bleeding, yeah. And not tell you what to do about it. Okay, you do you... Never get... there, that's a mage to the left. We can deal with her. Oh, very, very angry. I'm just reloading my gun. Don't, don't look at me. Uh, she has significantly more armor or health or both. Actually, maybe not. No, she does. Okay. I cannot... She's strafing slightly. I can't hit her. It's impossible. Watch out. Big dude. Big dude. Big dude. Big dude. Oh, no. Bail. I'm just you need to... Oh. Uh... Well... <laughs> Right. I don't know what happened, because she basically just self-destructed with ice. Uh, I hit her after she shot you. Or as she shot you. She never turned around. Don't worry about that. That's just part she of the game. at you, and then the projectile passed through her body, instantly exploding and no, killing no, me. No, 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 no. Come here, buddy. This guy's halberd still makes me so mad. Don't worry about that. We'll talk about that in a minute. Oh, God. Oh, God. I... Mm. You get stuck in I'm a little stuck in there. Don't worry. Run. Let's see if think we can take him. I just don't think we can. Yeah, you might be right. Oh, God. Nope. <laughs> That's like no damage. I'm going to run by and grab things out of the chest. Yeah, do that. I'll, I'll keep him distracted. Honestly, you could probably disengage at this point and he'll just get bored. I'm just going to oh. slowly walk backwards while holding block, and I don't think there's anything you can do about it. <sighs> he has a key. We can't get the chest without killing him. Oh, they thought about mm, it. Yeah, they did actually think about this. Damn. Um, we could try to jank this a little bit. Do you think if we hit him with a torch, he'd set on fire? Oh, maybe. Oh, I mean, your torch is... Is there a torch attack? <laughs> I don't think so. On my screen, you were dying so many times, but I know that's not happening. I'm just holding block and walking back. He can't do anything. I mean, I could ship him down, I guess. Loading my gun. Your gun probably does good armor piercing. Yeah, actually. All right, so we do this until I get aggro. Oh, we got aggro. Okay. And then you get your gun back. 
And then you sh make sure you don't miss. So I only got two more shots. Okay. I don't know if that hit. That, that looked, looked like it hit. He is still mad at me. So. I. Th yeah, that hit. That hit. Why don't they lose aggro on me? Do you have one more bullet or no? Nope. Careful on that wide swing. Yeah. Oh wait, I don't have my hatchet on me. Oh, mad again. Mad again. He's on you. I think. I wonder if me aiming at them at all triggers aggro. Oh, I don't have any ammo. One sec. I this was my backpack. Yes, it was. Oh, wow. He can actually break through my guard eventually. It just takes his entire combo, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> you can just walk backwards. Oh no, I fucked uh, oh, up. We're good. Attack. Rolling with the backpack on is like almost a, a death sentence. Oh, oh he, he, hit fucking, my backpack off. he hit me pretty bad. And then I can't see shit. Yeah, it's getting. The, the whole night cycle has uh, happened. It's gonna be dawn before we kill this guy. Look at this fucking combat. Look at this combat. It's amazing, isn't it? Nothing feels bad or weird at all. I'm just waiting for him to clip you. Oh, one interesting thing. You can't block arrows without a shield. Uh, also, Frosty, would you like a polearm? There's a polearm uh, in my backpack. It might be easier for you to hit him. And also be like long range stabs at this point. I honestly don't know uh, whether that would help me or not right now. I mean, obviously my gun isn't doing me any good. Your gun's doing great. Well, you ran it. Oh, ow! There he goes. There it goes. Okay. The attack animation is too long for me to sneak an attack in. Where did he get? Where is he? Oh, he's over I there. Don't see him anymore? He's following you as best he can. Oh, he's going around the other way. He got. Some you can't die until I let you die. You have to keep fighting this dude forever. And thus, the jank begins. As long as we both don't fall down, we can do this forever. He's mad at me again. See, when they run past me and do a quick Yui, that is really hard for me to tell what the fuck is going on because the camera doesn't track them fast enough. I kicked him, it didn't do much. Um, it, it got his attention. Hey, we got him! There we go. Just like that. Oh. Easy as that. Let me, is this mine? It's mine. Spurs. So you should probably take that Cleaver Halberd and use it. Got the key. Some arrow. Take that. Silver. Yeah, use that is probably the best weapon we're gonna see for a while. So this is true. I know you oh, want to use sorry. your mace, but you don't even have a mace I'm skill. Gonna, I'm just gonna take this out, and oh, anyone who's watching on my stream is just gonna see me just staring at this weapon for a while. Can you hold, if you, so you can you turn your lantern on so I can get a good view of this? Look Thank at this you. stupid fucking weapon. Someone took a regular two-handed sword. Well, I mean, I say a regular two-handed sword. The, like, the most god-awful, gigantic, impossible two-handed sword you have ever seen. And then said, wait, 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 this is too heavy because it's the fucking Buster Sword from Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> so they carved out a part of the middle and they put a handle over there, even though a great sword of this length would already be wielded this way with a handhold up there because that's how a Y-hander works. That's how, like any two-handed sword or any like great battlefield sword was working in the first place uh don't worry about it it's cool shut up yeah <laughs> what structural advantages are there here there's no cross guard even because the whole thing is flat it's just uh. don't worry about it we got a cool chest. we got a golden chest which is the best type of chest ornate and what did we win i got a dagger for me uh and then the, the rest of this we should probably just sell it Yep. Because fuck, fuck it. Uh, okay. Let me put this in my pocket. 
Now, can I hold this while I'm doing No, the bow and the dagger take up the same slot. One yeah, second. that's the unfortunate thing is, even though you can use the dagger while your bow is away, it, by the process of, like, I don't know, it's very silly. I'm just doing some quick slot stuff. Oh, that's gonna be intense. Yeah. The thing is, once you're doing a bow, you can't really do anything else. I mean, you could do the magic thing I was doing. Well, no, I can still just swap weapons, but the, the skill... Yeah. Dagger Slash. Um, it requires a quick slot. Yeah. How about I do... Hmm, give me a second to think about this. Okay, that's good enough. We'll, we'll see how that works out. The Dagger Slash is just a little slash, but it does a decent amount of damage. There's some really, really good dagger attacks later. Yes, there really are. Uh, including a parry that, I mean, is probably not worth doing anyways, but... <sighs> Parries aren't very good in this game, I'm gonna say. Okay, so I think we successfully it's killed... Combo so often, and the parry doesn't interrupt anything. It's yeah. Problem. Uh, I think we successfully killed the bandit camp way before we're supposed to. Yeah. We just didn't get that, that second power cell, unfortunately. By the time we get back here with the second power cell, they will have all respawned. Yeah, but we're gonna be... We'll, we'll have actual armor by that point. Mm, well, hopefully. I guess we can sell most of it. I mean, we can do the trog cave still. Well, I don't have any room. We should probably... Uh, oh, okay, fair then. I was picking Let up fucking everything. What, what room I have. Uh, yeah, I have like... 12 room left. Yeah, fuck it. In my bag. Let's show off super speed. Yeah! <laughs> the best part of the game. So if you name yourself Code Sonic, you get to run real fucking fast. And by run, I mean roll. Uh, because oh, the game has traps. zero fast travel. Well, I'm sorry. It's not zero. Once in a while, you'll find a guy with a cart, and he might take you to one location. That he has for predetermined. For an extreme price. For an extremely large price. There's no horses, there's no fast travel between regions, otherwise, it's just walk back, fuck you and your time. But then they added Code Sonic, and now I'm okay with it pretty much. <laughs> also, uh, lo like, none of these areas have a centrally located town. Either. Except for maybe the forest. Berg, yeah. Berg has a centrally located town. Even then, it's not. Dead center, but it's it's close. It's close, it's, yeah. But most of them are off, the, like the wayside. All right. The, the game's just mean. Hello there, alchemist. Would you like to buy six hundred swords? <laughs> Why, yes. I was in the market for that. Um, that's a decent amount of cash. I forget how to make, like, predator hatchets and stuff. I have a predator bone. Let me see if I can just craft it by memory. Do I need one or two? No. Oh, hey. For the price of one palladium scrap and some padded armor, I could make amylite armor. Ooh. I think I gave you my amylite. Yes, I do have that. Oh, here. Um, where the fuck did you go? Hi. Here is an amylite boot recipe. Ooh. I am dying oh, of thirst. That seems to increase damage dealt, which is interesting. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, plus 5% damage dealt, cold weather defense, and a little bit of stamina cost. And it defends you against magic? Oh, okay. Like just well, which magic? Uh, All magic? Blue magic. Oh, ice. It defends you against ice. Uh, it we doesn't look like ice. Every time I see the blue thing, I do not think ah, thanks. <laughs> uh, let's go and rest for real. Or is that purple? That might be purple. I purple have, is a I ethereal no, no, shit. No. It's gonna drop off some. Um, I, I'm just thinking about resting. 
You're thinking about it. Yeah, like your character doesn't get into bed like with a bad roll. If you're resting, your character just sort of stares at the bed <laughs> and scratches their chin. And you go, what? Mm. Yeah, yeah. yeah I shall contemplate that. the concept. Rest. Why do I need to spend a third of my life asleep? Oh, don't forget to repair. Oh, yeah. Uh, you can either pay someone an exorbitant fee to repair things, or you just do it yourself somehow instead of sleeping. Oh. You don't need any tools or anything. With no tools or cost or anything. Yeah, literally no no resources except for time and I guess food unless you're sleeping at home and then it's just time. It's very strange. Oh no, I should. Oh, that did not heal much of my health at all. Oh, okay. Let's I do it again. We're preparing. Let's just sleep until morning. Yeah. One of them nice level sixteen-hour naps. Yeah, easy. I can do that any time. I just pass out. <laughs> That's the real superpower of these characters, is their ability to just function with no sleep schedule. <laughs> Being able to fall asleep instantly and have a restful sleep, that's also a and superpower. And decide, I'm going to sleep instantly right now for three hours, no more, no less. I'm going to get up in one hour intervals to check for ambushes, and if no one's ambushing me at that second, they'll say, or if someone's ambushing me, they'll say, dang it. <laughs> uh, and yes, Shrike. Or not. Yes, Shrike, there is a uh, time limit on this city uh, that is kind of hidden, um, but we have plenty of time right now. Oh, actually, how much money you got on you? I have 90 silver. Okay, why don't we buy that skill that gives us better oh, health and right. stuff? Oh, yes. uh, increases health by 25 and helps uh, you restore health by 20% faster while sleeping. It's 50 bucks. It's really good. What can I do for you? You might want the steady arm as well. Amber, my friend. You don't necessarily need the shield charge, but. And honestly, oh, you don't need to do spell plates awakening. It's okay. I just opened my inventory to pop a soul item because I'm like, ah, I'm ten dollars. <laughs> do you? Oh, do you need money? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm okay. I'm sure, I can sell one of these. Got off the potions. Do not need your astral potions. I don't need your elemental resistance. I'm going to begrudgingly hold on to the blessed potion for the next time a, a shrimp comes at me. You should probably just sell it. It's probably worth more to just sell it, to be honest. That's going to simplify my life so much to just not care about alchemy. Right? It's so hard to care about alchemy. Alchemy's okay. It's just a huge pain in the ass. Yes, yeah, right. Sonic Code Sonic does kind of break that a little bit, but also I care about my real time more than I do about the game's balance. What can I? Oh, yeah, especially right. considering we don't know what those threats are. We don't know anything about like it's just sort of. Yeah, the game doesn't signpost it at all. You just have to kind of suffer, and then know for next time, I guess. Like it's not really, and I, I said this before. But it's not gamified hmm. in any way. It's just sort of a random consequence Is there something that's unique? trying to be like role playing, but it's not really. There's no role. <laughs> yeah, because you don't know. Hey there. Role playing in this story is so arbitrary that you don't know what is or is not going to be reasonable. You don't know if, hey, am I supposed to actually just be sleeping 24 hours or am I going to be punished for that? Yeah, because there's nothing in the game. The game never mentions. Don't take too long. You might have unforeseen consequences. It doesn't even do a vague post, you know? Yeah. It's just... Just shit, bad shit happens sometimes. And it's like, oh. Alright, so we're going to roll back to the bandit. And continue from where we were. Uh, we could probably kill these bandits. Oh, yeah. If I can quickly... That is super speed. Oh. oh, God. I wish I had a macro for that. Oh, God. I did that a little bad. Don't worry about that. The price I pay for speed. Uh, it does look like there are other arrow types, but I really just need to uh, get a better bow because that de determines the raw damage. Yeah, there are poison arrows that are being sold at the, um, the Watchmagal place. 
It's taking me a while to pull my bow out. Oh, do I not have any arrow? Oh, there it goes. I guess I just oh God, barely whiffed. It's not going very good. No. Fighting a human like this. It's definitely it's easier when I have you. Just trying to do the sword and board combat is just not. Kim doesn't want you to. He can just block. And if I try and kick, which is supposed to be the counter, he immediately unblocks and then hits me with a weapon before my kick even comes out. It's like. Uh... Is he dead? Oh, I was just coming over. Oh, wow. Yeah, you got fucked up, huh? Yeah, don't worry. I'll eat some. I'll eat this bouillon de palette. I'm Canadian. That's the correct. <laughs> it is very strange that blocking with a tiny little machete against a gigantic weapon like the one you have, the game doesn't really care that you're doing that. Yeah. You could just block. You could just block it. Why not? And it doesn't stagger them or impact their stamina or anything. You you would just the blocker wins almost every engagement because mm -hmm. you can just stop a blocking on a dime and start your next animation yeah so. there's no like impacted your block animation to prevent you from doing anything it's weird yeah so like the enemy you know they do a three hit combo against your block and if you try and like stop blocking at some point between there it's like nope too bad yeah zero hits done yeah uh, but if you're the one blocking I mean, it comes down to just the economy of you taking a hit is much worse for you than them taking a hit is bad for them. True. Uh, I'm going to grab those and that and that. You can have that. Yay. I'm actually going to eat that stew because I need some health regen. Probably a good idea. I don't know if this food I ate actually is giving me anything. Depends on the food. Also, I don't think I had... Sh oh, I did have shitty shoot fun. I'm going to make a campfire. I have a pot if you want a pot. Oh. Oh, I can't use magic on this one. <laughs> I was just going to make, uh, I guess I can make some tartine. I can make some gooberry jam. Make some meat stew. I can make some gooberry tartines. The vegetable is apparently berries. Don't worry about meat that. Berry stews. Just don't, don't worry about that. I'm going to drop four meat stews. Uh, I have meat stews already. Oh, you do? Yep. Okay. Oh, also, food goes bad because fuck you. There we go. That's I mean, how Breath of the sense. Wild. Is it good gameplay? No. It, that's how Breath of the Wild comes back because food never goes bad in that game. That's, oh, how, it's a, that's how it's a better video game. I mean, I would, it would be a better out. video game if Link got food poisoning <laughs> and spent two weeks just sitting on a couch uh, regretting life choices. I mean, that might make a good video game. Who knows? All right, I think I have the key to this puzzle right now, so I'm just gonna go use this over here. Oh, there's two doors. Shit. The DM of my campaign. At least we know this is a small, small sapphire. Small sapphire. We might get one in here. Uh, yeah. He uh, made the poor choice of, and I just learned this. Apparently, pasta, even though it's like not a meat or anything, it, it goes bad quite quickly. Mm. Like the noodles themselves go bad quickly. Didn't know that, but yeah. Well, they're full of water, right? I mean... Oh, water gets bad. In the water gets bad so fast. Hey. He's stabbing you. Sure is. That's a that's a good weapon, though. There's a friend who's uh, on their way. Oh, yeah. Look at that guy. I'm gonna drop my backpack for this one. Oh, yeah. That would have been a good start. I keep like somehow. Oh, he's just walking backwards now. That's that's cute. I think he just buffed himself. That's a yeah. Oh, that. What guy. gameplay? On my skin, it didn't hit me. Oh, okay. That thing clipped into the. Oh, he fell down. Get him. Oh, I om I almost slashed him. Almost. Actually, wait, is this slash just, like, really bad? Because I can use it repeatedly, so I don't think it's very good. Uh, I don't think it has any multipliers. It's just, yeah. you know... It's just there. It lets you use your generally uh, 
the better daggers all have status effects and things, so... Oh, true. Unless you use those. Also, I am burning through arrows. This is not sustainable. Not, uh... Mushroom shield. Ooh. It's probably worth something. We need to... We need to give that to a person. We learned. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. Because we ran... We, we rummaged through this place looking for it later. Did not find it. Alright, there is a dude. I think you... Yeah, you see him. Slap. Slap. Wait, what? How'd I switch to my... Here we go. Slash him. Slash him. Big slash. Little slash. Little slash. Wow, this skill sucks. Probably not going to use that for a while. I do appreciate that having the... Uh, if I was using that, those troglodyte spears, they do they are a light source. True. They're not just glowy like everything else here. God, this game loves its emissive colors so much. At one point, I know there. at one point there was a monster we couldn't see properly because it was so fucking shiny. We couldn't see the animations. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I think that's in uh, this region somewhere. There's a... Uh, it's like a lightning a thing, dungeon. right? That's all lightning stuff, yeah. I was like, oh, yeah, the sparkle dog. From the, the fact that it wasn't a specific memory <laughs> to me because they're all like that tells you a lot. What's in the mushroom chest? The trog chest. One linen. Oh. Do you want to pick or no? We don't need to both carry one. No, probably not. I'm going to take that one and switch it with mine. Hex cleaner. It's worth something. Or removing the hunch disease. Awesome. The best way to move, remove any disease in this game is to fall over. <laughs> and then when you get back up again, no diseases. They only came up with the one status effect that ignores that, and that's corruption. Yeah, and that one's brutal, actually. Bag's overweight. Your bag's overweight. Uh, yeah, my bag's a little bit overweight. Not too bad. Yeah, we're fine. I mean, we killed the main boss, the main chamber. We got at least one chest. I know there's other stuff in here. Yeah, there's at least another uh, pocket to look through. And I'm really hoping if I can mine some iron, I get the small sapphire. Yeah. I'm just oh, there's dudes. Oh, he just doesn't care. Oh wow, they're both on me, huh? I didn't notice that until I almost get hit by one. Wow, he, oh, wow, he just ran away! Where's he going? What the fuck's he doing? He's like returning to a, a waypoint or something? I think he's just scared. He's the last of his kind. Oh no. Not for long. There we go. Did it. I got a piece of wood. We did it. Oh, I cannot I'm carry that. Picking up these drug spears. I have just the right amount of them in my pockets. I do not want more. <laughs> Oh, another one. Ow. Did he get you? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> God. This game does turn into just a spam your attack button sometimes. Yeah. It's... I don't know. It's just too... It's trying to match the, like, fluidity of, you know, it just doesn't have the... It just doesn't. You're taking the heck out. It's doing its best. Yeah. Uh, we were not in here. Yoink. Uh, Hackmanite's really valuable, actually, but it's not what I yeah. want. I want to get an item so I don't have to come back in here again.
I wish their spears weren't so heavy. Yeah. Because then we could actually collect more of them. Oh, I can make bandages now. That's nice. I guess we've been here because that could have been. We've been that way? I uh, think so, yeah. Oh, wait, this is the beginning, isn't it? This is the beginning. Yeah. This is the beginning. <sighs> yeah, Did we make the perfect campfire? Did we miss it? <laughs> yes, the most perfect of bonfire. I don't think we went this way then. This might just wrap around to another room. Yeah, okay. I think we've actually cleared this place. Except for the goodie bag up top. I don't remember what it is. It's probably not that good if we can't remember it. But... I remember being disappointed. <laughs> That's true, yes. Yeah. We were disappointed. This way? Yeah. Problem with... The problem with this game that we're playing, that has so many problems, uh, it wants you to grab things to make money, but then you're so overburdened with garbage that you're like... I guess I gotta go walk home now. It gets better over time as we get lighter and more valuable things to carry. Mm -hmm. But we should probably sell everything we have right now. Yeah. It's just so many trips back to town. It is. But otherwise we don't make any money. And money is the only resource that matters. Pretty much. That's all of your skills come from that. Uh, most of your gear comes from that. Or at least requires it to some extent. If we can, if we can buy a power cell, we should absolutely do it. Because that backpack is anyone. nuts. Oh, wait a minute. The trip back isn't too bad with Code Sonic, but without it, oh my god, I'd, I'd be upset. I'd be very upset. I mean, likely it would just be a different style of play where it would be I pick up the silver and nothing else. Yeah. But it feels disappointing so to much. do that. Yeah. Because it's like, look at all these shiny things strewn on the floor. I'll take none of them. Goodbye. But it's realistic. Yes. The ultimate aspiration for any video game is realism because and that's why we play video games. And that's also why we don't have a horse and carriage that we... I'd be okay if we had to pick things up and carry them in our arms to a carriage drawn by a horse. And we have to bring that into town later. As long as we could put a whole bunch of shit in that carriage. You know? That'd be okay. Yeah. Yeah, you're not wrong. What can I if you want to give me realism, then fucking go for it. Don't cower down on me. Or just have one of these guys figure out, oh, hey, these people keep going back to town with loot. I'll give them, like, a 20% worse price, and I'll just <laughs> follow them. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, the Hackmanite's worth 50. It is very valuable. Uh, we need another tiny aquamarine at some point. Yeah. Hmm. I think that's all I want to sell. So I've got 160 bucks right now. Uh, how much do you need to do your first piece of armor? Uh, okay. What Is it like know? 500? No, it's not that bad. Uh, hey, okay, so if I wanted to do... It is 400 for the armor, 250 Oof. for uh, boots or helmet. Okay, we'll have to come back for that. That's well, too I much. Have some money on me. I haven't sold everything yet. No, I haven't sold most things yet. Oh wait, something I remember need? there's a quest giver who looks identical to every other random NPC. You there. No. Yes. You. Helen. Uh, I'm here for about work. What do you need? I found that rare mushroom you wanted. Yep. We definitely have... 70 bucks. Damn. Oh, is that the guy for the shield? Yeah. For the oh, shield. nice. Good call. Well, here's... I'm going to drop this money on the ground. Here's your money. Sweet. I just threw the change right on the floor. Here's what I need. Okay. That brings my total up to 250. Okay, yeah. You what probably do want this armor before we go into um, the prison. Yeah. Oh, I am tempted to see if I can get up to 400. Per... Hold up. Can I talk to you? 
I'm not talking about <laughs> He's busy, okay? Close enough because of this slope, and if I'm- You could walk up- there's a fucking staircase right here, you can walk over here. Why? <laughs> I don't want to face away from him, that seems rude to come at him not in front of him, you know? There'd be no honor in it. There'd be no honor in that at all. I'm gonna just hold the antidotes. We don't need antidotes where we're going. This is, guy doing. this is still not gonna get me up to where what? I need to be. That's okay. Fine. What, what, what is this guy doing? He's, he's putting a nail into a log? Why would he do that? Carpentry. Why would anyone? There's no reason to do that. It's a full fucking log. Just, what's he do? Hmm. Don't worry about that. Uh, how many days? Um, Let's find out. Journal. 24 hours. Ah, yeah, we could do that. Boom. And then we should probably beeline to the prison, just to make sure we don't lose this place. Yeah. I mean, this is only going to get me in. But it's something. It's pretty good, though. It's good hat. Uh, well, let's, turns out, a lot of people don't know this. You know where your brain lives? <laughs> it's in your head. That's pretty a impressive lot of knowledge. don't know I didn't. You... Uh, give me a second. I'm putting stuff away. Okay. I just can't tell sometimes if you're actually right, right. downstairs or if you're, uh, you've been cursed. Um... Also, I have some arrows. I'm going to throw them into the fire. Oh, thank you. That's exactly where I want them. Perfect. They... Yeah. Alright, just slam it on the right. We... We're going to do some repairing. Yeah. The fact that excess repair doesn't go into like stuff in your inventory oh, brings you sell value and like it's like for your for your pickaxes you have to equip the pickaxe to and go to sleep and then it repairs. It's like why? Like why why? I don't understand sometimes how they go from system implementation to um to this like what was their order of operation? <laughs> How did they not see that as a... Wrong way! Plan? Wrong way! Oh no! I'm gonna talk to them and the armor's gonna pop up here in the so. What can I do for you? Is that true? Oh, right. oh no, it isn't! Oh good! The one time it didn't yeah. do it! Yeah, helmet. Wow. So what are the stats on that? Okay. This has... Plus 10% mana cost, plus 4% stamina, minus 4% move speed for a hat. Wow. Heavy wow. hat. Uh, but it's 2 protection, 14 resistance to physical, 20 for uh, purple and fire. So, an impact resistance I, I do actually like the way the stats work in this game. So, if there's a shield icon and it's like 1 or 2, that is a damage reduction number. You, If you take 10 damage, it will now be 8 damage. The resistances with the four with the little swords, that is a percentage damage that happens after that, I think. Mm -hmm. So you can like you can get some really good, really high damage reduction, and that will just you'll take almost no damage. It's crazy. Yeah. If we find some palladium, I think you should be wearing the other armor set, the uh ammonite one. Sure, ammonite, yeah, sure. Cause, yeah, because that I mean it's a bit heavy like the padded equivalent, but it is uh, plus damage, so you can do more with your arrows. Ooh, okay. We'll have to scour some more beach. Well, we're going to a beach right now, so actually. Yeah. Uh, we can zoom, like, over... Up to the, the fork in the run, at least. Oh, yeah, I love that they fall over. Oh, hey, that guy's not dead. Behind you. Oh, uh, oh yeah, we yeah. forgot to set ground rules, so we're going to use Code Sonic whenever we've been to a location. To save ourselves sanity. Because, you know. Yeah, I know. Weird. Did I sell my... Oh, no. My axe is equipped. So, you probably want help. Eh. I can just... If, if he stays aggroed on you, I can do a lot... Ah, there we go. I ran into the small issue of... Uh... The guys started flanking me. Mm. My lock on. It wasn't that I couldn't block the attack. It was that my lock on changed the direction I was facing. Gotcha. But you can't just not be locked on. Wait, this one's not mine. Shit, but... This one's mine. I'm honestly kind of tempted to grab a spear to assist you from the side, but I'm not sure yet. 
I have a whole rant about spears and games like this. <laughs> we don't need to go over that. We don't. Oh, need well, to actually, we could. Right? I don't know if anyone's heard that on my stream. Um, okay. Uh, this how is, no one this uses them, right? Sort of rant, but it's uh, work in progress for a video about this rant. Um, the problem with spears in this game is <sighs> how, how do I begin? It's a long pokey stick. What could be? Well, how could they do it bad? Against trash mobs, in a lot of games, it does work good. Because if you hit first, they get staggered. And if they get staggered, you don't get hit. So it fulfills its purpose, which is it is a defensive and offensive tool at the same time. That's that's the point of a spear, right? That's the thing it needs to do, is be defensive and offensive. The problem is, as soon as enemies don't care about getting hit, it's no longer worth anything. Yeah, if you can't stop them from moving into you with the spear, then... It's just... It just becomes worthless, and it's so sad that that's how that works, but... I think this is like... the Hound Den. I don't think there's anything of value over there. I don't think so either. We can probably, probably skip that. Yeah. Because, um, yeah, the, the moment that an enemy can either get past your range, the moment that they don't care that you hit them first... Like, I'm okay with a game like Elden Ring where, you know, you need to hit them with the attack part. You need to time it right. You can't just hold the spear out. That's that's fine. Because that's there's a lot of there's a lot of things going on really fast, and they dodge to the side. And all of the spears in that game are slow as shit, <laughs> um, and don't do any good damage because, I mean, that's how they have to be balanced, right? They have to do less damage because they're safer. Because they're safer, yeah. And they are much safer when fighting random mobs. Again, when you're fighting a boss, they offer no advantages at all. Because the enemy walks right through your attacks. And that extra bit of range is generally offset by just the fact that it is slow and it is a straight line. And the enemies in Elden Ring are so fucking agile, they're just going <laughs> to jump over you. They're going to move to your side. They're like, they're, You're going to stab between their legs more often with a spear oh, than God, you would yeah. miss if you were using a fucking fist weapon. This is my rant. Thank you for coming. Uh, there's a longer version of this I could probably make, but that that is the rant time I've allotted myself today. Uh, since that rant is over, look at this cool mountain. We can actually walk all over it, and there are multiple entrances. And we'll be doing that. Walk all the way to the top of that mountain. Tippity top, top which is which actually is. not where you want to end up. The top is not where you want to go. It's just There's a, a bad sword at the top that you can turn into a good sword if you combine it with four <laughs> random pieces of trash. That's another rant. <laughs> the, the fucking crafting system in this is fucking stupid, and they should feel bad they made it. Because they never give any hints. It's just random shit. It's just so silly. It is a cool trope, though. But we'll get, we'll get more into it when we actually see the item. Uh, so, as a reminder of what we're doing, we're going to Vendival Fortress, which is way down here. Started up here, kind of cut through. We ignored this section because it's stupid. That mid left section is just. Who cares? I listen to this exciting music, this travel music. Wow. I'm so inspired. It is a good sound. It is good. It's just, we hear it so much. It is good music, though, I, I, I will admit. Like, if I could get this quality of music for, for what I'm making, I would be so happy. I don't think that's going to be Drop your backpack. Case. Drop your backpack. I'm working on it. I did hit two of them just now. Oh god, why is the back... There's like a back step with this spear, but it puts me so far back that I can't hit him. Yeah. Because it doesn't care about what direction you're holding, what the distance is or anything. No, it's just... This is the animation. The animation is, is happening now. Thank you for attending. <laughs> I gotta get real close. It's not a bad, you know what, it's not a terrible move if I'm trying to dodge someone's hit. Also, the fact that you can block a spear with a sword is fucking stupid. This should be an should unblockable be weapon. Element at that point, but that's a whole other video game. That's at least more mechanics, and I can understand why they wouldn't want to do that. But if they say arrows can't be blocked by weapons, then it neither should. should. Thrusts can't be blocked, right? Yeah. Piercing attacks. Yeah. Just like the Toho game has piercing attacks. <laughs> which is a gun. A gun is a piercing attack. Just a gun or needle throw. 
<laughs> Vampires weak to gun. In there, you know. <laughs> it's probably true. Yeah, probably. Not in in vampire. Vampire there. Uh, oh, it's one of those downgraded. huts that I don't think we ever figure out what the fuck they do. Wow, that's a lot of arrows. Ah, huh. lucky me. One of those huts over here. Also oh, another. Right. The like. Is that a post game thing? Is that what I that is? So. I think it's related to enchanting somehow. I'm not really sure. Mm. Actually, I'm gonna tell. Oh, these, the green fletched arrows are poison. Got it. Yeah. I probably really want to use these on that boss. I mean, we are not going to be fighting a boss soon. What, do you, what am I talking about? I'm crazy. So this is a cool thing. Just, mm -hmm. Look at the quality of these assets, though. The Wendigo and the Mantis Shrimp coming out of these posts. That's really good, actually. Yeah, I'm very impressed this, by that. This was like, actually... Oh, those assets are part of this video game. Yeah, that means they cussed unless some... No, they probably actually did pay someone to make this asset. Yeah. Uh, we didn't talk about it. This game looks like it's mostly asset flipping. <laughs> they just... But, like, weird stuff won't be, right? Like, this hand hide over here mm -hmm. uses the weird, like, armored-plated shoulders of the deer in Berg. Like, they, they are paying attention to how their own things work. They mm. do try and be consistent a little bit. But other things yeah, are clearly like... not... <laughs> And then later you'll walk into a cave and there's 300 of the same naked lady statues. It's like, whoa. Yeah, uh, if you come over here, I think we should go and sleep and then we can get more sand. Yeah. Oh, you're right. It's a, unfortunate we'll lose our buff, but... Unless we want to just see what happens by the time we get outside. You want to do that? Uh, we're going to be living in... My estimation of how this is going to go... Just don't agree to him this time. <laughs> Don't do it. It's gonna be funny for stream if you do, but it's gonna be a fucking pain in the ass if you do. This game is weird. Oh, shrimp. Depending on what, how Frosty answers some questions in a moment. Wait, are we on the right side? We're on the wrong side. We need to keep going southeast. Ah, what? You're... Facing 180 degrees. Don't worry about that. And you hit me anyway. Don't worry about that. Ow. Oh, I don't like this one very much. Well, Trip can have some. Oh no. I'm good. Are you yep, down? You oh, you're down. Yep. Oh god, he shot through himself on me. How rude. Gotcha. Well, now the sleeping. Oh. Oh no. I'm you're fine. You're fine. Hold on. You're fine. You get hit on wake up, which isn't isn't very kind. Did not block. Tried to block. Didn't did not. Can't recognize the difference between an attack that is and is not. What? What? What did he? Oh, he dodged because you attacked at him. I see. Yeah, just fuck him up. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, you didn't drop your backpack. Not a single time. No, I didn't try and dodge a single time. I oh, I see. Blocking. <laughs> didn't work out for me. No, you can't block this without a shield. Can you even block them with a shield? Yes, you can. 100%. Not, oh, sorry, not the not the point blank AOE, but the projectile you can block. Okay. Which is why the AOE is such a pain in the ass. Because you can't, you can't block it. kind of hard to tell the difference. That's yeah. Yeah. Uh, we cut too soon. We gotta go east and then south. Okay. Also, it's telling me to build another bandage or use one. Maybe it's telling me to bandage to get my health back up. Oh, maybe. It's trying to tell me yeah. something. Now it's happy. Now it's happy. Okay, it went away. We did it. We did it. I think the bow is going to be better once I find something that isn't the starter bow, because that damage does yeah. skyrocket. Oh, absolutely. Is that bird chasing yeah, me? Getting yeah. poison arrows is also going to help you. I think that's Ooh, just yeah. crab eye seeds and... Oh, wait, I can make... Oh, sorry, oh that makes sense. Crab eye seeds uh, and, uh, and arrows. And, like... Oh, and just add it to arrows. Okay. 
I do I have so, some. That's how you make poison rags. Uh, so I'm just gonna grab Wait, firewood now. What the fuck is this? Is. We've never been here. This is a new dungeon. Huh. Oh. Oh. Another trog cave. I didn't notice. All right. Well, fuck it. Let's go. Trog infiltration. Oh, all right. Well. Did you need to heal or you could? Ah. Uh, what's a trog gonna do? Can't hit your head. You've got a helmet on. Exactly. It's I'm very... still wearing basically just regular. I, I'm still wearing like jeans and a, and a thick coat. Oh, uh, that's a good looking mace. That's a brutal mace, actually. I recognize it. We're bullying him. Yeah, that is a super good mace if you can if we don't die here. Oh. Oh, behind. Oh yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go for the alchemist. Just try not to die. Yep, 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 yep. Oh he's mad at me. He's okay. mad at me. Uh oh. Oh my god. Uh oh. It was just pitch black. I could Wait, where the fuck is here. uh oh. I'm going somewhere. It's just glow effects I can't see. I don't know where I am, but I don't like it. Oh, I think I got poisoned at some point. Neat. Oh. There is no... Oh, I am... On those I areas. am quickly dying. I need to get you up. Good luck. I am already poisoned. And at one health, I'm down. Amazing. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. I'm on, I'm on the ground. I'm trying to go, go, go. Uh, I got. I have to kill this alchemist. Yeah. Just try and stay alive to pick me up, because I'm going to go. I'm down. <laughs> okay. Take some time to heal. They don't see you. Oh, he's, they see you. They see you. They're coming. They're coming. Whee. That fire spreads like crazy. I'm alive. Yeah, like any of those anime, any of that is. Alchemist is down. How you doing? You're doing fine. I'm alive. Oh my god. If I hadn't just been holding down block this whole time, that would have fucking killed me. Because <laughs> uh... he does a full 180 with some of these attacks. There is no safe angle. Please, sir, I just want to stab at you. I have a long weapon, but my character refuses to move forwards while holding it. <laughs> Trying to do that stab so I get that that safety range we were talking about. We're bullying him again, but this time he doesn't... Oh. <laughs> Hello? Sir? He doesn't see you. <laughs> and I just disappear. Sir, can you? Did not I also can't see you very well. I'll be honest. Yeah, I'm. I'm just a figure in the darkness. My helmet glows a little bit. Does it? Oh, there. Yeah, it kind of does. Your head's in the fucking wall, though. <laughs> you know, small problems. Oh, I'm glad I picked up the spear. It's been very helpful. Okay, this we're guy fine. Been throwing, doing nothing but throwing. Uh, you want them? That's well, actually, a troglodyte pole mace. That is not a. Uh, oh, well, that's hey, palladium. Nice. Palladium is a pretty valuable uh, resource. Yes, we can use that to make. Um, Let me set. I combine that with padded stuff to make amylite stuff. This is like twenty-seven damage, seventeen impact. That's way better than that spear. So I guess that's my new weapon for now. Yeah. Uh, can you give me that amylite? Oh, it, ju it just uses the fucking... Sorry, what? Can you give me that am... Or, uh, palladium, rather? Sure. I shall make for you a hat. Ooh. I like hats. Is this a damage hat? This hat will increase your damage by, I believe, 5%. One amylite helm. Am I gonna turn into a glass cannon? Can't take a hit, but I do a shit ton of range damage. So there's the one DR, nine resistance, and five percent. That's actually a really solid hat, yeah, yeah, especially right. for now. Oh, sorry. Let me get a good look at myself. I look like an asshole. 
Oh, wow. What, are you... what is that even? <laughs> How is that a helmet? It's like I have a big jaw thing. Like, okay, I, I like an armor with a good bevel, right? Like the big <laughs> collar that comes up and protects the top or the mm -hmm. bottom half of your face. Mm -hmm. I like that. That is just a bever and no helmet, and it moves with your head. So what? I don't know. I don't understand. I don't know. Uh, well, this was an interesting little zone. Was that it? Oh, there's this chest. Oh, you took out everything out of nothing that. good. Nothing in or nothing unique. Notable. Yeah. Oh hey. Oh, is this the prison? Yeah. Or is this nothing? Is. That's weird. Well, we'll see that in a minute. Get through to the prison. No, I no. Think it's just an illusion to like, hey, this is connected to a bad place. And I think you can see it the other way around. Hmm. Well, that was neat. Is it a gorget or a, a gorget? A let me. Interesting. Let me look this up. We need to find more amulet. I didn't realize it was that good. I know I didn't like it as much as the sand armor because I wanted max defense. Because this game, it's really hard not to get tagged. <laughs> the lack of iframes is definitely brutal. Okay, a gorget goes all the way around and it kind of protects more of the shoulders and the lower neck. A bever is the thing that comes up to your chin. Interesting. Well, I've got I know the this bever because then. I had a, a one of my writing projects had a character very specifically had a bever and was very specific about calling it that. Oh, I see. Cause... Oh, we're sleeping out here? Okay. Uh, actually, I guess it doesn't yeah. matter. No, it doesn't matter. Oh, actually, is it... What time is it right now? Only one way to find out. Yeah, right. I think I'm not too far away. Just not yeah, a lot of room on that to be night time, so actually, why don't we check the beach and then sleep? Oh, good point. Yeah. I'm positive there's more amylite. Also, there's a dude with a really good... Oh shit, does he have good armor or good shield? We gotta find good out. Shield. We're gonna murder him. Yeah. Whether he likes it or not. On the right way. Yes. I think so. uh, there's some dudes. Oh, my health is burnt. I have about half burnt health, by the way. I have about uh, seven eighths burnt health. Just oh, that, that's an archer. That is an archer. Like, you want to use your weapon and just, like, hit people, but if you hit people, they're just going to hit you while they're you're hitting them, and it's a lose. They The game wins, you lose. Only if they happen to... Oh, hey, this causes confusion. Also, I'm just going to walk around this guy for a minute. Look how fucking bright that I, article of... Like, you can barely see... You, I can't see his arms right now. I don't know what he's yeah. doing. He's just fucking know. shiny. Oh, you're dead. This guy got confused, though, so it's kind of a wash. Just, just let me... Oh, he's no longer confused. Oh. Oh, good news is I... Oh, God, you almost died from that. I'm alive. This guy won't stop blocking. And it's costing me all my... Are you dead? Anytime you hit, they will hit you. I got him. It's so bad. Uh oh. There we go. I put my weapon in my. Weapons don't carry any weight if you're holding them, by the way. So it's really awkward if you have a really heavy weapon, then you switch to something else. Because uh, then you can't move good. Because you have a big, heavy item in your pocket. Sir. Alright, I'm gonna lead him away a little no. bit. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just sit here. You're just resting, you're relaxing. I'm doing some cool acrobatics. I'm getting flexible. <laughs> My legs are going off in different directions. That's fine. Good. It's good to stretch. Ow. I can't see a fucking thing. Yeah, it's really dark right now. Just wait till he glows. Oh, never mind. <laughs> uh, yeah, the glow effect is horrible, especially at night. You just can't see what they're doing. The arrows. That guy's bow any better than yours? Uh, that guy, uh, where's the bow? Over here? Assuming he also had a simple bow. Yeah. I'm taking it. Because I'm greedy. But, that's, you know. <sighs> um, what the fuck is that? There was something in the shadows. Is that a bird? That's a bird. 
Um, okay. We will... My backpack's full, just so you know. I could drop troglodyte stuff. Or... Yeah. These serums aren't that good. Neither of the machetes, to be honest. We can start to be a little discerning. A little bit. Okay, that's just a I mean, bundle just of money. so much loot in that place. Like... Yeah, the place we're coming up to, as long as we don't die horribly or, I don't know, get enslaved or... I, I don't know why that would happen. Uh, we will no, be getting a lot so of weird loot. if we just answered a conversation wrong and <laughs> instantly just teleported to a basement with all of our gear gone. Yeah, that'd be so weird. I'm glad that's not the case. Ooh, there's fire arrows. Huh. Yeah. I'm actually paying attention to this stuff now. That's neat. Oh, yeah. Give me uh, I might have some arrows on me. No, I don't. Or I have two arrows on me. I'm going to try and... I, mean, I'll take them. I do have a bunch of crab eyes. I just haven't cooked them yet. Yeah, no, that's what I'm going to try and do. Oh, I guess you can... Yeah, you can do that with my crab eyes. Let's do that when we go down to rest. Yeah, where... Uh, did you take the... Yeah, you own the two arrows. It says so. Where are the two arrows? Are they in your equipment? Like, did you accidentally... Oh, they them? are. Okay. Because yeah. bullets don't go in your equipment. No, no, no. Those go in your Wait, equipment. really? That's weird. They also don't display in the, like... Oh, the they don't? The oh, that's awful. Hey, look, more dudes I mean, to there's come. only one type of bullet, right? Oh, there's two dudes down there. Yeah. Um, I'm going to eat some stew because I am dying. I'm going to just take box shots. What's he going to do? Hit me? Oh god, he's going to hit me. Ah, uh, the other one's right there. I think I'm slow because my... Yeah, my big weapon's in my pocket again. If they're looking at you, it's re this is a real easy game for me. I, I have to say. <laughs> I just keep hitting them. Another simple bow. Okay. Gonna... Don't you do it, bird. Oh my god, get the bird! <laughs> this bird is so pissed! Oh god, don't hit. I'm trying it's to get. like geese in real life. Oh god. The goose of outward. a fantasy game, finally. Okay, it's gone. Oh yeah, don't try to chase those birds. Those birds run really fucking fast. Drop. I'd, wait, why am I holding this armor in my... What is wrong? If I take this out, am I... I'm good. There we go. Okay, I won't be overburdened if I take out my bow now. So that's a plus. Okay, it's actually getting closer to dawn, so we should probably hustle. Yeah, fair. Oh, interestingly, uh, there is a stealth mechanic in this game. Also, hey, Neko Abyss, who totally isn't Crazy Penguin. I don't know why I'd, <clears throat> I'd say that. Looter arm. Do I have arm? I do. What is that? Oh, I've got... Mysterious. Uh, that dude's around him somewhere. It's like a, a fairly unique... Guy. Is that him? No. Uh, let's, can we go east and then south to avoid, m I see a bunch of dudes and I just kind of want to sleep. Yeah, no, that's fair. I want to get my blue sand and go, go to bed. And they can't deal with us because every, every 15 minutes I have a timer and I, uh, I get up out of bed and I squint at them and they say, <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> they caught, oh no, she caught me. What am I going to do? And then they run away. <laughs> it works every time. So yeah, the blue sand only appears at night. Which is, I think this is a cool mechanic. I wish they had did more with this. Yeah. And like, that's the last piece of blue sand we're ever gonna everything else is just to be sold. Oh, I got two out of that. And a azure shrimp. Very nice. <gasps> Amalite. Yeah, Amalite. Do I need more palladium? Uh, yeah, it'll Damn. be more palladium to do that. And more padded armor. But... Oh, okay. Well, that's cheap. Uh, you're already wearing the boots, so I could change those out. But you don't have palladium? I, I would need palladium. Okay, okay. Uh, we need one, at least one more piece of amyloid, which might be on this beach. I don't know. Yeah. What am I looking at over here? What, are, what is this? Oh, that's salt. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, the boats. These boats will be referenced later. But we'll see them again later. This Thanks. game's weird. Last piece of ammo light. Okay. I mean, we'll get more ammo light because it's decent to sell. Yeah. God, if the, the amount of wealth we had in the chest at the end of the last playthrough <laughs> is, like, fucking ludicrous. Okay, give me your boots. Oh, no, play. No, no. That's okay. You can give me the ammo light now if you want. I don't know how I forget that again. You can give me the, the ammo. Mm -hmm. Blue stand. Oh, right. Where's the same? There's the same. Um, oh yeah, we're going to bed. Time to sleep. We do need to get better bed rolls at some point, but, you know, priorities. Go for you need more than I do, so... I think 12 hours ought to do it, I hope? I don't really have a good baseline for what an hour of sleep does. Eh, that's uh, fine. We also got that health... Yeah. Uh, that sleep booster, right? Yeah, we did. Oh, no one ambushed us. We squinted at him. So one thing we could do if we were psychotic, if we were like, we really need some bandages or some basic gear, we could just sleep and not uh, guard at all to trigger fights on purpose. <laughs> um, it'd be very strange, but we could do it technically. Okay, apparently I'm going to need, like, five more hours of sleep. Oh, fuck, okay. Sorry. No, it's fine. I mean, drink my drink. It's too much effort to code in the ability to drink water while you're sleeping. Oh, that was the wrong button. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just showing off. I'm on the ground over here watching you. <laughs> I'm just so good at doing this, I wanted to show it off. Uh, oh, actually, I need more sleep, too. Can we go, like, here, and then... Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll see if we get unlucky here. I've never seen a... Oh, no, I think I've seen one random encounter. It's actually nice to have a major... Oh, no! Dudes! Unnatural sounds. The middle of the day. Oh, no, over there. Oh, he doesn't even see us yet. Ten feet away. <laughs> Sir, I didn't even hit you. Why are you mad at me? Oh, there is another one on the other side. But okay. He doesn't see us yet. The guy who ambushed us doesn't see us yet. Yes. <laughs> Fucking nailed. Listen, we we got our percentage sir? Check, So we, even though they stumbled upon us, there's a clip plane no here. We can't, we can't actually get to him. <laughs> All right, we just take a step back. It's fine. Yeah, we'll relocate. This is his natural habitat. No, I didn't mean to go to sleep. <laughs> God damn it! Side of the clip plane. I don't think he can get to us. He cannot. <laughs> this is a this is a video game. So what happens is they're like, okay, random encounter. So we take player camp location. Yep. We add a vector of this length in any direction, and we check. Hey, can we spawn enemy here, or is that in a wall? Is there no ground? Whether it's on the right side of uh, <laughs> any clip plane. No. Nope. Check if it's in another area that'd be an extra team. boolean that's too much work one extra ray cast for that while the player is sleeping the lag spike would be unbearable <laughs> okay i'm gonna eat some food and i think i'm ready to go are you ready to fight i'll like go in yeah i'm very slightly wounded but that's fine yeah i'm not too worried i'm gonna i can eat a mushroom bar you want a mushroom bar yeah sure so mushroom bars are neat because they give you they're a quick bite to give you a tiny, tiny bit of burnt health back. It's not a lot, but if you happen to have a bunch of them in your pocket, you can just fucking stuff your face full. Oh, that's salt, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna grab that amylite and... It's up to you if you want this to be really funny or easier. I mean... Stream needs to know what we're talking about. Stream needs to see it also. Yeah. I do just gotta... Oh, I guess that is intentional, isn't it? This is a wall, and then the fortress is around a corner inside there. Yeah, kind of. Uh... The first time I looked at this, I was like, ah, oh, oh. this is the inside of the castle. 
If you put your camera into the wall, the left wall, and look right, you get yeah, some can... problems. Oh wait, left wall and look right. Yeah, the camera is in the left wall. Oh, hmm. And you like if you look at yourself too, you stop existing. Oh, your head's gone. Yeah, a lot of a lot of pro. I don't know exactly what's happening, but it's not good, and I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. They can see all of these things because they're covered by the wall that you're seeing through. We don't. We don't have anything else going on tonight. Uh, we're not stopping until we get out of the fortress. <laughs> oh boy. All right. Oh, hello. Hi, Croc. Well, now. What a lost traveler, have? come warm yourself inside. A we'll take good care traveler? of you. We'll Either I'm just passing by, or I'm looking for a place to rest for a while. I will say, yeah, I could use a rest. I'm looking for a place what to rest for a while. For you? We have plenty of free rooms for weary travelers. And we hand over all the Enslaved! And are enslaved instantly. I'm doing this mostly so I can see my haircut again. <laughs> it's so fucking stupid. Now, if they poisoned us or did, like, there's so many better ways to do this where they walk us into a room and give us a meal and we eat it because we said we would and then it fucks with us. Like, uh, something. Or just we go to sleep somewhere. Like, they walk us somewhere, we go to sleep, and we wake up without our shit. That's one thing. But no, it's literally, you have a conversation where they say, Oh, we'll take good care of you. And now, oh, here we are. So, uh, the thing is, we're gonna break out instantly and not do the question here, because it's fucking stupid. No, that's not what I want. There's a way to, I think there's a way to do your job a little bit. Yeah, you like mine or trade or. Yeah, and fuck, fuck that. Fuck that. That's stupid. Oh yeah, there's the um. Is there something? There's the answer to that. You can buy a shiv. Southeast is the answer to the puzzle later. By the way, southeast. Oh, that's right. You can buy a shiv if you want. The shiv isn't that good. No, it's not. Wait, and with what money? Well, actually, I just got stuff I could sell. I suppose. Is there something you need? Hmm, twenty dollars. I don't have enough to sell for twenty dollars. So yeah, here's our here's our new prison life, and that guy's doing great. That guy's doing fantastic. Um, this is all mineable. I'm not gonna bother doing it right now because it's heavy and I don't have a backpack. Let me get a feel for this weapon. It's not good. Not good. Are there torches anywhere? Can we get a torch? A torch would probably be better than this fucking thing. Can you use um, a torch as a weapon? I'd like to I try. It was an offhand. I can I can punch. It's not that's plain. We might be able to make a torch out of if there's like a piece of wood and some linen. Yeah, but we're underground. There's no wood down here. Can't possibly, you know, get crafty with a bed or something. No. Um <clears throat> excuse me. I guess we're just gonna go for with the pickaxes and hope for the best. Is there clean water here? Uh clean There's river water. Can we actually not have clean water down here? Because that's extra mean. Oh wait, this prisoner here. Oh, he just gave me a amazing pearl bird thing. Okay, if I mine the iron. Maybe I can make a ship. Um, do we have the recipe for a ship? Uh, cloth knuckles is linen. I don't. I don't have that recipe. Uh, yeah, I don't either. And all of my recipes require... Almost all of them require some sort of wood. It would be funny if we made traps and just lined the hallway with traps in front of them. <laughs> and then initiated the fight. Oh, uh, we could throw ourselves down the pit, but then we'd be... You know. That's not helpful right now. Oh, wait. You got eggs from... Me. Oh, yeah. I got eggs, I yes. Got that guy. Go give the eggs to this lady. We're oh. trading up. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Oh no. This come is on. gameplay. Uh, oh no, come on. Oh, she wants a miner's omelet. Is there a bonfire somewhere? Uh, don't know. She taught us how to make it, allegedly. 
Well, she taught you how to make it. Maybe she gave me the recipe for it. There it is. Yeah, uh, we need a miner's omelet. Some sort, right? How would I cook it? I don't have any wood to make a bonfire. Is there is there a bonfire placed anywhere? Hey, wait. Let's find. We could come back down here later and give it to her, I guess. <laughs> that would be very weird. Be We're... like. All right, you've earned this. Oh boy, okay, two silver. Money from her for giving the. Two silver for iron? Oh my god. Yeah, we're not we're not doing that. Is uh something you need? This is interesting. Does he sell wood? Very good. Okay, you can buy wood for eight silver. Oh my fucking only god. Two pieces that they sell. And only wait, you can't buy three? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Why can't I cook on these sconces? And wait, we don't even have a fucking cooking pot. I can't do it anyway. Okay, wait a second. Okay. Can I do this without an alchemy? Give me one linen. There's a ki there's a kitchen, but not down here. Definitely not down here. All right, all right. Well, all right, Frosty, we gotta we gotta just do what we don't want to do. One second. I'm doing science. I have created fire. Would you? I do not need the tools to light it. This is fine. Ha what? What'd you do? I have a fire cloth. I, I bought a piece of oil oh. and a rag. And uh Alright, let's start pissing them off. I pick X on fire and kick these people's ass. Uh first they got a transition from being <sighs> I knew your dad. Help me get out of here. Do this for me. Put in a good amount of work and bring me thirty silver and I'll smuggle you out of here. I want out of this place. Oh no. Let me out or you die. <laughs> it's foitin' time. Back the fuck up. They're on me. Is that actually letting him on fire? Not yet. It has a build that all statuses do, which I learned recently. Ah, oh, interesting. Dodge. So they have big armor. We don't. The handle of this pickaxe is on fire, by the way. Don't worry about that. Trying to keep I the other one still to hit me for some reason. Don't jinx it. To run Don't jinx it. I've gotten hit. You're actually kicking his ass. There we go. <laughs> Alchemy. <laughs> uh, if you want to lure her, I'm gonna grab some stuff. Just gonna, just gonna walk backwards slowly. I've got a knife now. Ow. I've been injured. My pride. Just fucking slasher. Just fucking slasher. Oh god, my face. Nice! That went really well. That went shockingly well. The last time, my goodness, that went very The last time, it was me running in circles, picking Frosty up off the ground, and just sending Frosty over and over at the problem. While I was staying alive. That was my job. Uh, they're all mad. Uh, we're gonna let reason. we're gonna let them in and run backwards and then go through. Okay. Yeah, I don't have any more fires. So. Yeah, that's fine. We're not fighting. We're not fighting. Them. Oh, I'm overweight. That's a problem. Ah, uh, drop that. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Come on, buddy. They don't have the key to their own jail. Oh God, you shut it on me. There we go. I didn't press it. Oh, that's oh, weird. Ruin it. Just updated. Uh, I believe our stuff is this way. There are a bunch of people sleeping on those beds. That's fine. Don't worry about that. Hey, yeah, here we go. More um, fire rags. This one's mine. Is this my chest? Yes. So, on the ground. On the, oh, that was just flopping around. On the ground. On the ground. I am shocked at how well that went. In the pocket. In the pocket. I'm so glad we locked them in their own prison. It's actually kind of cute. Okay. Ability potion. Oh, there's so much shit I got about the edge. 
Um, everything that's happening on my screen to you is great. You're just sort of bouncing up. Oh, no, now you're fine. <laughs> oh, you're shit. just sort of bouncing up and down uh, inexplicably. Don't worry about that. I'm going to put armor. this extra I mean, shit over here. Say again? Sorry. Uh, looter armor. Okay. I got padded armor on. Oh, nice. Then again, um, one, we're one place. I should probably wear that. Or do you? are you wearing that? Uh, I'm wearing this. Do you want the... I threw the looter armor on the ground. No, I have looter armor. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just make sure you don't throw out that um, that armor. Right. Because I need it. We're yeah. going to turn this padded armor into something else later. Yeah. Okay. We'll probably... Drink you some know, we'll, water. You know, we have to win at our way out of here first. But we'll probably come back here with nothing in our backpacks with Code Sonic and just get a quick loot afterwards. Yeah. Also, hey, this is clean water. Oh, hey. I mean, I already drank from my water skin. I can gather, at least. Uh, drink, please. Thank you. Um, drop. Oh. Okay, yeah, again, that went shockingly well. Oops. I had never thought that paying attention to the crafting system would do something. <laughs> would actually be beneficial. Uh, oh, wait, do we want to... This is the boss, isn't it? Uh, not just up here. No, it, I'm pretty sure it is. No, the, the boss is up a elevator. Oh, there is a boss. This is a boss, yeah. I'm going to get my poison arrows out. Yeah. Hey, do you want to lure him? Actually, are we... I think there's an archer above us. Yeah, there he is. Oh, he's got a friend. Oh, yeah, that's the guy. Oop. Drop your backpack. Right. Oop. I can see them sticking in him. I can't tell if he's poisoned or not. Oh, he's poisoned. He looks poisoned. He looks like he's having a bad time. I'm just going to lure him in circles while you deal with that guy. With your I'm flaming just... greatsword? Holy shit. I'm just brute forcing it. I, I, I did not dodge a single head. I just went. Time is of the essence. Let's, let's just hit him. And it kind of worked out. Is he still poisoned? I think he is. I'm apparently just playing aggro management right now. Oh, Are there's you... two archers. Oh, you're gonna die if you go up there. Oh god. Yeah, I'm going running. You're right. I'm running. Oh, that doesn't give me any health. That's that's not meat stew. That's a mushroom bar. Okay. All right, I think we can pull this guy out. Let's just keep going backwards. Yeah. Can I shut that? Yeah, we can shut this door. Now we're in here with... Oh, I don't have that key for that. I can't. Well, the archer didn't show up. Is he still poisoned? He's still bleeding yep. poison, but... It's not a lot of damage per second, but... I need some... Ticking damage numbers, you know? Ah, oh, that fucking state. There we go. Nice. So this guy has one of the best shields in the game. Unfortunately, we're not using shields. It's worth a lot, though. There's a free poison arrow. You even get those back sometimes. Ooh. Just one? I guess. Oh. <laughs> not often, but, you know. That's yeah, better than nothing, I guess. There is a ratio of, oh, I'm going to make bandages and use bandages. I'm gonna kill this man. That seems like a a fair choice. Oh wait, I didn't want to do that. I want to swap this. Is he shouldn't be that he shouldn't be that tough. No, they they were generally not. Oh, I'm dead. Just eat this. <laughs> Pick it well, my body's sliding down the, the staircase if you'd like to. Thank you, gravity. Thank you. Gravity just got a redemption arc after Dark Souls. <laughs> okay, there we go. That also went rather well. It's like we're good at video games or something. Or we may have done this once before. No. You know, whichever. There's still one more archer. Is there? Who's just been putting arrows into the railing the whole time. Oh, please don't go down over there. If oh, wow, going. he ragdolled. Nice. I just kept hitting. 
It worked. Wait, how many arrows did he put somewhere? There's one. Oh my god, he, he put a bunch. Yeah, he put a bunch in the walls and stuff. Hmm. Alright, well, what's the loot in here? Bend of all key. Yes, that's important. Ooh, there's a brutal club. You, you're doing club stuff, right? Oh, yes, I am. Well, uh, brutal club is a two-hander. Oh, you're doing one-handers. Okay. Is this better than the weapon you have? I would say no, probably. Well, let's find out. It does apply confusion, which is more impact damage, which is nice. Oh, yeah, for reference, uh, confusion is the purple effect, and it gives 25... It makes them take 25% more uh, impact damage, which is really good for knocking them down easy. My thought is the cleaver halberd probably sells for more, so I'm going to switch to this thing. Fair. For it's closer to what I want. We're getting closer. Oh, I forgot about the secret dock. You can't do anything here, though. It's like a weird just... ship that's slightly on fire, and... I guess this is the pirate ship, right? This is what they would use to besiege Sierzo, the starting town. Allegedly, they're pirates, so, yeah. Allegedly. There's some arrows and stuff over here, I don't... Yeah, we, we really need to make two trips. <laughs> if I drop the looter armor, I can pick up a lot of swords. And by a lot of swords, I mean not very many swords. Wait, if I do this, I can't hold. Uh -huh. Shit. Having to do inventory math. What fun. Alright, now do we want to let those people out of jail? or are We, we should probably out? rest, honestly. Oh, yeah. Oh, we should go kill all those people in that other room. Before we rest? You uh, mean the sleeping? The sleeping people? Yeah. Oh, we probably should. Yeah, but the game won't let us because it's a coward. Are we not allowed to kill these people? Nope. Well, I made miners' omelets, so I'm going to go give one to that lady. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I'd have to go. That would be the bad, bad direction. Yeah, you think we'd be able to kill these people? Because they're like criminals and, and they're, you know, out for blood and slavers and all sorts of negative negative attributes you could put on these people. But they're sleepy. But they're sleeping, so that would be dishonorable. Mm -hmm. I feel like they put that room in to be like, and see, this will be an opportunity where the player can do this, and then someone oh, else like, I can't actually implement that. This is stupid. Ow. <clears throat> Wait, the Brutal Club is one. What a what? Oh, it is? Well, that's a shiny bunch of people. Yeah, let me put my backpack down. I'm gonna try to angle from the, the left side a bit, so... <laughs> Locked in their own fucking prison. You guys don't need to be up against the bars. You bring us 30 uh, pieces of silver. <laughs> You might say we're cheesing this, and you'd be right. Let's fuck it. This is not something anyone else would do this if their enemies were standing at a gate. Yep. Also, that guy is tanky as fuck. Yeah. Glad we're not fighting him for real. Did not fight yeah. <laughs> I thought these were just goons. There was a boss fight we can't cheese that we have to do at some point if we want to save the city. Oh my god, this dude. And I'm using a pretty good weapon. And your weapon's on fire. And also good. And on fire. Hey, there we go. There we go. Oh, I can't. I don't have the key. <laughs> I have the power here. Cr His name is Croc. Hey, life potions. Oh, that was the guy who enslaved us. Because we ah. answered the wrong You should key. grab those keys off his body. Yeah. What was his weapon? Where is that? I think it's another Brutal Club. Yeah, another Brutal Club. Okay, well, those are very valuable. Yes. Um, 
Okay, let's do this puzzle real quick. I said southeast, right? Um, Pretty no, sure I did. I thought, let me, I'm oh. just going to drop this bag and check. You'd have to go run through some enemies. No, those were the two enemies we'd have to run. Hmm? Those were the enemies we would have to run. No, no, they're not. We locked them in the prison, remember? Oh, there's more in the prison. Yeah. I'm also almost dead. I don't. I really don't want to fight. Okay, fair. And then I do not remember. I think it was either southeast or northeast. But you trust your instincts. And... Pretty sure it was southeast. I'm with Elchak. And if we're wrong, we'll have to wait seven days and come back. Because <laughs> video oh, games. Okay. This is southeast. I was right. Yay. What do we win? A brittle grape mace, which I think is two-handed. Yes. And some other shit. That is also good. Cannot move. Oops. You I dropped your backpack. backpack. One moment. I'm gonna go find my backpack. One moment. Just pour all these valuable goods on the floor. Beside the chest. Um bag is also overweight. Stupid machete. These guys and are all Oh, that's an arrow. Oh. Four pieces of wood I can get rid of. Oh, this is the entrance. We can actually leave right from right here. Yeah. Okay. I think... Let's see. That recipe. We want to be efficient with the way we gather things and bring them back. I guess we don't have to do too much. Hmm. As long as we pick up the most valuable items, like the uh, the br anything that's brutal, is very yeah. Cool. I want to get that back. I just there's so much shit in my inventory that is yeah. Also, arrows are kind of heavy, by the way. Turns out, yeah. Uh, tattered boots. Right, I can drop the long sword and the iron mace. I think. Yeah, those don't matter. Let's, let's take a little run. I'm gonna see what I have. I'm gonna drop a recipe for you. I don't know if you need it, but. If I equip this brutal great mace. Iron spikes are valueless, basically. <coughs> um I can make more arrows. Travel rations lighter than other food. 0.5. Yeah, I actually. Would assume so. They just provide mm. no benefit. Actually, no, they're, just... they're not. They're the same weight. Oh, okay. Interesting way. It won't stop telling me to put a fucking bandage on. Uh, this is my pile of garbage over here that we're not picking up. So if you want to add anything to that. Uh, I've already thrown it, strewn it across the floor. That's fine. Mm. Do we want to go back now? Rest? I think so. And then sell everything we can out of our bags? Yeah, I think so. And then hopefully we can get some... Uh, I can afford to make the blue sand armor and maybe we can get you the... If we can find a piece of palladium. Oh, that'd be really shop. good. Yeah. yeah. All right. So... See if we can get the next round of upgrades. Oh, if we could buy a power cell, we could give you like 50 more fucking weight. Yeah. That'd be nice. I wish I remembered where power cells were. They must be in pretty specific locations. Yeah, you would think. They would oh, wait, wait. There's a man here. Where's the man? Is that him? That's not him. We want to find? We may as well find the guy who has the uh, either the good armor or the good shield. Wow, that is some stagger. It's like he's wearing nothing. Purple is so. <laughs> it's pretty bright. Uh, another guy here. Just blocking. Just blocking. 
Can't hit me because I'm blocking. Wait, this is my other attack? It's just a... Oh, wait a second. How many... Oh, my weapon broke. Okay, can you give me your, uh... That brutal great axe? Brutal great mace? Whatever. Uh, you want the great mace? The two-handed one that you don't want. Yeah. Right, you don't want it, right? Yeah, no, I, I don't want okay. it. I'm just holding it because it's heavier. Uh, yeah, this does, like, a lot of impact damage, so I'm gonna keep that. Where okay. is that dude? I swear that dude's unique to this area. There he is. Oh, there he is. Oh, he has a great mace. Something. Okay. What you doing? I don't know. I threw a bomb at him. I didn't even see anything. And nothing happened. Oh. He's confused. Oh, it's just a shove. Wow, that does a ton of impact damage. Oh my god. I don't know if that hurts him. Did he roll out of being on the ground? Yeah. That's what that looked like to me. Ow. Oh, that hit. That hurt. This is such a close range fucking shove. Oh my god. Look at this warrior. He just happens to have armor on. What a challenge. Ooh. This guy's tougher than I remember. I'm just getting stamina back, don't worry about it. Yeah, same. I just walk backwards slowly, he can't do anything about it. <laughs> Boy, I can't. I haven't much. taken off my backpack this whole time. Oh. Also, my boots got damaged from walking. Amazing. I mean, that's how boots get damaged normally, right? That's fair. It was just a cute detail I've never had happen before. Nice. Bandit defender. Small sapphire. Ooh. Oh, hey, that's what we need. Yeah. Nice. Where the hell is my bag? All right, I'm taking the. Tower shield if you want to take the other thing. Bag. Oh, wait, I did? Pretty sure. Oh, yeah, I did. I have a gun now. Wow. Wow. Where's my bag, then? There it I is. I don't know. I found it. Is everything's fine. There, there we go. <laughs> what they're not going to do, none of these days, <laughs> these boots are going to walk. <laughs> you raise it a good point. Next that bird is pissed. Bird. The bird... Come here, bird. I can't walk good. Yeah! If you just shove the bird yeah. down, the bird dies. This bird didn't have any eggs. Alright, we are There's going. A male bird. Oh, yes. Uh, so, yeah. if you're too overweight, you can't run as... You can't roll anymore, and you run way... You run a bit slower. It does scale. But now I just look like an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> it looked fine when power I could roll. Jogging. Just power jogging through the universe. It's either this or we spend multiple hours, multiple hours just being, walking, doing nothing. I need whatever gives me more stamina. Unfortunately, being overweight, I think, does take more stamina out of you. I'm just gonna Not sure. need an endurance potion. No one can stop me. Oh, I wish I had one. I have spicy tea. That doesn't actually help me here. Like, I don't, why aren't there carts? Why aren't there horses? Like, uh, that thing is too soon. Or the more north. For the amount of garbage they give you, it's just weird. For the amount of stuff they did put in this game, it's weird that those things weren't the first priority. Yeah. But I guess probably they didn't know what they were making when they were making it. Is a, uh, a common issue with games like this is... Like, this game looks like scope creep. <laughs> and yes, Saint, uh, we are not enjoying turnips because we ain't doing magic, because fuck it. It's not very good. Fucking magic. Fucking wizard shit. 
Is there? Well, that. Not the right way, exactly. I already ate. This oh, the stew isn't increasing my stamina regen. Maybe the miner's omelet does. That would make sense based on. Ah, there we go. Now, I, now I'm getting stamina. Now it won't drain as quickly. Don't die, don't die, don't die, I'm fine. I always gotta worry about falling off things when you're going super speed. Because gravity oh, yeah. gravity stings. Because we're going so fast. Yeah, obviously. Come on, Pearl Bird Nest. Give me the egg. <laughs> oh yeah, bird's nests are really valuable because they give you eggs, which you can cook into hard-boiled eggs, which are surprisingly good. Okay, I'm back at the base. Almost. Almost. Almost there. <sighs> there we go. Campfires don't run out of fuel. That's not realistic. I want a campfire simulator game where <laughs> the campfire has, you know, this long, and every time you cook something on it, the campfire gets put out a little bit more. And uh, the it long dark is pretty. From your the long dark is pretty close. Uh, that's fair, yeah. What? I don't think you like you don't lose extra heat by cooking something, but all right, it does take time, which takes out you know resources. Okay, so I'm selling the brutal. You have a brutal club. Yeah, I'm, okay. I've got a brutal club. I'm selling an excess brutal club. Wow, that's a lot. Weaver halberd. I'm sell selling a tower shield. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, don't need a possessed potion or a stability potion. Mm. Probably don't need a nice rag. What else do I want to get? Probably fine. He's never going to sell a good bow, is he? I don't think he is. Alright, I need to put a bunch of stuff in the base for later. Ooh. What'd you make this time? Uh nothing because he didn't or didn't have quite enough money. And he yelled, What was that? in like a funny voice. <laughs> yeah. Uh because I have I have angered him. Hmm. How could you betray our favorite blacksmith? I know, right? Do I care about occult remains? I don't think I do. Hmm, nah. I'll just home. That's free, that's free, that's free. Keep that. Probably at some point in the distant future we'll have to come back here and grab, like, extra gems and stuff, but... Yeah. Actually, it's point one. I can... I can manage. It's more the, like, disorganization than any of that. Yeah. Okay, now make me the armor, my friend. Also, you have to learn the recipe to put oil into your lantern, which is very silly. <laughs> it's it's a little silly. for blue sand armor. All right, guess we're sleeping. Let's see if I can get. You have plenty more, my friend, blacksmith. Okay, I'm gonna walk around to the side like you keep, keep telling me to do. <laughs> Palladium, yeah, my Palladium, my stamina is, or my well, my stamina and my health are super burnt. I'm gonna also buy a bunch of bullets. Ooh, it turns out guns need those for food. Interesting. They eat the bullets, you say? Yes, that is accurate. Uh, I'm gonna cook these crab eyes now and see if I can actually make some poison arrows. Also, it's important for you to know that there is, when you are not, whether it is loaded or not, when you're not in combat, you still have the gun in your hand and your finger on the trigger. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Just at all times, if you're jogging through town. Yeah, you gotta be ready, you know? Wait, how do you make poison arrows? I can't choose arrows as an ingredient. Interesting. Uh, maybe they need to be made from scratch as, like, wood and... Oh, I see. Uh, crap iron? Let me try that real annoying. Quick. That is annoying. You wouldn't oh, apply poison later. Oh, true. 
Uh, let me grab the scrap oh. iron. Let me grab some wood. If I didn't need the scrap iron, that would actually be super nice. Okay, let's do wood and crab. Grilled crab eye. Invalid. What if I add iron scrap? Invalid. Interesting. Hmm. The one nice thing about the crafting system, the order doesn't matter. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> God damn. Oh, damn it, CP. It's true that when guns jam, it's often a feeding problem. I could see that, yeah. <sighs> <laughs> oh, I get it now. Yeah. <laughs> I reacted to that before I actually got the joke. <laughs> wow, I feel like a bad person. Um, I'm gonna go around and see if anyone has a recipe for poison arrows. Yeah before we slumber. It could also... Is there something this would be you dumb, need? but it could be... Well, let's see. Hey there. If you need to apply it to a poison rag first, that would be very silly. That would be pretty dumb. Oh no, I used all my rags. What can I do? Oh, right. No, these people don't sell that kind of stuff. No, mm. they didn't. I'm going crazy. Okay. Why would they want to teach you about a poison arrow? My goodness. I know, right? All the scandals. This is an honorable town where you fight people to death with a sword like a gentleman. Okay? And then have blood debts. Yes. And yeah. then enslave their children with a blood debt. Yeah. yeah. We're thinking that... Uh, So you're not sure what to do with that, but that's okay. Also, do you need any food? I'm gonna, gonna try. Okay. Try something to do with this, this rag here. Uh, it would make sense that it's like a rag-based thing. That poison rag, fire rag, whatever else. You just add that to arrow ingredients. I can't add that as an ingredient. Really? Yeah. This could be an alchemy yeah, thing. Right. Somehow. Huh. Oh, that you need to do this at an alchemy station? Yeah. You know how alchemy classically involves a bunch of wood. Oh, there was an alchemy station in there. I just never picked it up because we were too full. Oh, uh, true. Well, that's fine. Okay, for now, putting that away. Um, I'm going to keep the amylite arm on me because it's light and, you know, I want it. Yeah. Those are good reasons. Yeah, right. Trying to put some of the shit. If we're sleeping in town and it gets destroyed. I think we're okay. I think all I have to do is kill one more person anyway. I'm just gonna sleep a lot and then prepare. Just... We need to do twenty four hours for your armor anyway. Yeah, exactly. And hey, maybe the merchant will change to having palladium suddenly. That'd be nice. Actually, it would be cool if you could sleep here during the attack and then wake up and, like, repel them. It would be interesting, right? It'd be, like, kind of a niche environment and encounter, but it'd be pretty cool. The only time you can respond is if you're literally already there. Is there something you need? Let me check the merch. Traveling merch. Greetings, friend. To collect yes. my armor. We could travel with him to Harmattan for 200 silver. That wow. Well, my friend. I don't know where that is. Well, me neither, actually. You said you have a small sapphire? I have a small sapphire and padded armor. Okay. Where'd you go? There'd you go. Oh, when it, the trading garb is interesting because it gives you an eight pouch bonus. You can carry more in your pouch. Oh, thank you. That is not a small sapphire. That sapphire is as big as my hand. That's right? huge. Maybe that's small for sapphires. Alright, I'm going to put that padded stuff away for now. Fair. We're going to be grabbing as much as we can. Yeah. And also the knife. I don't want the knife anymore. I don't know why I'm still carrying it. 
Um. Okay. Yeah, we're not gonna grab everything. We're just gonna grab mostly important stuff. Do you need any food? Uh, I don't need any food. I wouldn't mind putting up a cooking pot for a minute. Do you want my cooking pot? I can carry it. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Let me and grab some water. Us actually having. Actually, some. I like water too. Wood. Oh, actually, why don't I just head to the the house for a second? We. Let's see. Oh, that's a bed. That's not where food gets made. Oh god. I basically can't carry anything in my pouch other than the one weapon or a bow. It's interesting. It's a little restrictive, but it's probably fine. Alright, let's sonic our way back when you're ready. All right. We should actually go to the Trog Cave first, because we have the Sapphire. Yeah, that's Just to get that over with, and then we can go fight a get witch. Get that weight out of our inventory, that heavy Sapphire. Oh yeah, it's, yeah, it's weighing me down. Emotionally, of course. Yeah, that makes sense. How can I carry so much wealth? When some have so little. Zoom. But yeah, it's so easy to see how much time we're saving by Code Sonic and how we're not missing any content. Like, we're just not missing any content. We're just saving hours of time. Tens of hours over the course of the like, entire playthrough. Even if it was just a, like, game speed goes up by 10 when yeah. you're, you know, not in combat or something weird like that, that would be fine. But, gee. Where the game sped up with you, you know. Yeah, or something. That would still be okay. I'm pretty sure there's no one in here. Yeah. Alright. We spent a sapphire and aquamarine for a great life potion. An iron sword and a scavenger coat. What's that coat like? Better than what I got, but not by much. What are the boots? Um, they... It might be better than what I much. have. But yeah, this is like a beginner dungeon. The reward isn't very good. Yeah, I don't know if those boots are better than anything you got. Five, four. Nope. Trash. Yeah. On the ground. So my my armor is a I little bit a better. Cap. Yeah. Gives a pouch bonus. I guess I could carry some more um, arrows on me now. Which is, you know, not bad. I got pockets. I'm very curious about the person who's like, okay, what's better than iron? Palladium. <laughs> These are the only two materials. In the world. That's right. If I have this, Dude. I don't even necessarily know if it's wrong. I, and you know, I went to university for that shit allegedly. Allegedly. Um, but for some reason, no one talked about the practical applications of palladium <laughs> in my metallurgy class. It's weird. It was all just. Hey, here's 17 different kinds of steel. Because turns out steel is very good at everything. Huh. I didn't see that. Yeah, crazy. <laughs> it's like we use it for everything for a reason. But I thought everything was going to be made out of carbon fiber. Someone somewhere's mad at me. It's probably fine. I hear the. I heard the music. Okay, combat music. I yeah. thought you meant like for saying your opinion on carbon fiber. <laughs> Someone somewhere on the internet. Um, One of those material okay. science fandom people is gonna be mad at you. Oh, absolutely. They always are. God, that is a full stamina bar at so Code Sonic speed. I went the wrong yeah. way again. I keep going west too quickly. And now you're making that mistake. I mean, I haven't looked at the map once this whole time. I just followed you. No. I just always turn too quickly. What's this? Oh, hey, it's this again. 
I did the exact same path, only we didn't look over here. That's garbage. Yep, not good. I'm gonna eat this minor omelet. One second, that's gonna give me some stamina back. There we go. Imagine what a major omelet would do. Oh god, yeah. The fact that travel speed is now fucked if you gave away your stamina to become mage. Oh, it's a... There's so many ripple effects from the travel being bad. Yeah. We'll I mean, it, Elden Ring and I think Dark Souls 3, you don't lose stamina outside of battle, right? Uh, I think it's just Elden Ring, but I mean... Mm. There's not that much time outside of combat in Dark Souls 3. You're not walking a lot unless you're walking past enemies. True. In Elden Ring, there's a bunch of empty space. But also, you have a like horse. That. Like, sure, occasionally Firelink Shrine or whatever, you need to go talk to someone who's at the very Code top Sonic. of some shit. But... Turn off that Code Sonic. Can't be cheating. We would oh. never. Um, I think that's to the boss. What are you doing? Oh, your gun. I'm gunning. Uh, we should probably clear out the, uh... Oh, hey, these people. They got out somehow. Your spawn point is on this side of the door, and their position isn't safe between... Yeah, you're fucking right. Jesus. I mean, I don't see why they would for a game like this. Hey, you never know. How you doing over there? Because I can't really... Or loot, whatever. I can't really push this guy that much. Oh, oh. I helped. Thank you. I just, I realized that both of us were kind of not getting too far. Yeah, it's and easier I'm... if one of us teams up. Um... Oh, there we go. Now he's fucked. Ow. I'm gonna need uh, a little bit of healing, but that's okay. Loot bandit. Linen cloth. We're just systematically destroying this organization. That's fine. More sleeping people Except we can't kill. Ones. These five sleeping people are sacred. Hmm. Oh, we can't actually disassemble. No, this is permanent. Interesting. That's weird. Right, I'm gonna give this lady her fucking omelet. I'm not gonna free anyone, of course. That'd be that'd be silly and unethical. We broke out of jail and did not give him. Oh, I don't think we can talk to them while, uh... I, I can't talk to that person anymore. Yeah. Oh, hey, there's a shiv over it. What? When did that person die? What the fuck did this happen? Do you see what's happening here? Uh, that person got shivved to death. Yeah. Yeah, but do you see that she's also standing right next to... Oh, I thought that was someone else with the same... Oh, yeah. Okay. Don't worry about that. It's the same NPC! <laughs> don't worry about that. I'm gonna do some mining now. Don't mind me. I'm doing this for fun. It's different when it's a hobby versus a job. <laughs> oh my God. This is how the doppelgangers win, okay? Is when people see sites like this and they walk away. Mm. Oh, so... I'm, a, I'm just gonna make the bet that we won't see this normally. So, if you get in here and lose, and you're not on hardcore, the bad guys take your body and throw it down this pit, but then you you don't die, and you crawl your way out. And Frost and I got thrown down that pit like three or four times in a row. <laughs> and we just kept coming back, and they kept thinking, ah, this time, surely, the fall will kill them. We the just... hole has never <laughs> failed before, the <laughs> hole will not fail us again. And it's just kind of silly. Uh, I'm going to wait for you upstairs near the elevator. We will redeem the hole. This is the hole's chance for redemption. Okay, let's see. Let me just reload my gun. One one second. I need to switch to Oh. I wanna to switch to these arrow. I wanna put this great light potion in my pocket. Oh that's a good idea. Do you have any? My potion. Not great ones, but I have here's two. This I think I'm regenerating health right now. Very badly. I'm gonna eat this meat stew. There we go. That's a little better. Oh, actually, yeah, fuck it. I'll eat this fish one instead. Oh, now I'm getting mana recovery. Oh boy, that's not 
<laughs> Not really one I wanted, but... Yeah, take this. This health potion. Oh, okay. Thank you. And then, uh... I don't know, I'll assign this to... I'm just gonna leave my bag down here. Yeah, same. We've got poison arrows. I've got my brutal great mace, which I can swap out, and it won't... It, it won't, won't overload your overload bag. me, yeah. I'm gonna start off trying to poison the witch, and then mm. run around screaming. Sounds good. Oh, right. Uh, you get to go forward and talk to them. I'm gonna poison the first yeah. person I can. Talk to Belira. I'm just passing by. What? Oh, no. I am curious I if there's a way to talk to these... Wait, what? <laughs> we can't do anything like else? Guards, prisoner, take them no, to the jail. I just warriors. pressed escape and walked what? away. Not today. Now we're in combat. Behind you. Oh my god. Oh, you're dead. I'm fully dead. She hit me one I think she did a shotgun on you. Yeah, that's not how that should work. <laughs> that's not... <laughs> Come on, game designers. You know that's not how that's supposed to go. Is she dead? No. Oh my... Yeah, that is a triple. That's a triple. Yeah. I might just kill her with the arrow damage. Oh my god. This rate, yeah. I'm not trying to do this by myself. I'm, she just won't come out of there. No, it's okay. She's a ranged character. She likes to stay back. Oh, of course that would hit the fucking invisible plane there. Of course it would. Did they lose track she of me? She's hiding so far back in a corner right now. Well, I would too if I had that little health. Oh my god. What? She just didn't take any damage from those two. Yeah, she just didn't get hit. Oh. There we go. Wow, that had a lot of uh, impact. Okay. Hey, look, poison arrows that I missed with. <sighs> oh, yeah, her robe has, like, really good stats on it. We don't care, but... You know. Oh, I don't know where the fuck that arrow went. Nice. There's one more... Where's he dead? There he is. On the there right. He <laughs> you just ball out your gun! <laughs> it's Bloodborne. Like, this man has not drawn his weapon. Parry this. Alright, let's go get our backpacks. The gun seems pretty good. I wasn't really sure about it. It is a very long reload. It is very much a, you know... You don't reload it in combat, you, it is used for in cover, but I think that's is... fine. Uh, this... this one's here. This one's Oh, we can tell by the um, the yeah, lantern yeah, right I now. I was just... Once you start standing on the icon... No, no, the lantern, because we have different oh, lanterns. That's better, yeah. yeah. Once you start standing on the icon, it's not very useful. Uh, these guys actually didn't have very good gear. They had arrows, though. Oh, his Legion stuff. That's worthwhile. What's she got? Arcane robe. Oh, wait, I stole else. one of your poison arrows. Oh, no. Made a mistake. Made a mistake. Yeah, those poison arrows are really fucking good. Didn't right. work on her. There's also one over here. Oh, you know what? She had resistance to poison. That's why I didn't poison her. Oh, I Because of her outfit that you stole. <laughs> you thief. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, yeah, this, uh, I appreciate the poison arrows are easier to find because they glow. Yeah, like right. Poison does. Can I actually grab this one? Ah, oh, it's too yeah, far away. Oh, can I? You can grab it from here, yeah. Going. All right, the prison has been completed. That didn't take that long at all, actually. No, that was not that bad. I did not expect to start this, uh, this run and get the prison done in the same session. I mean, we did the bandit. We did most of the small dungeons. Uh, sorry, the bandit land. Then most of the small dungeons, and then the actual prison. Uh, that's, like, super, super good. Now, what else do we want to carry with us back home? I'm mostly just grabbing anything that's, like, a weapon. 
those usually sell for at least a little bit. Yeah. Not the machete. I think the machetes are not super valuable. It's not, but I don't. I have a, a bit of room right now. Uh, what's there's the loot room down here. Machete, 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 machete. machete, machete. Oh, I accidentally lock you in. Right here, I think. It was to the left. Yeah. Oh yeah, we should buy the or take the crimson shield home. Claim more. Yeah, that's valuable for sure. Now I'm a little over numbered. Uh, that shield's pretty good. The round shield. Yeah. Uh, Because I would like to quickly travel back to town and not have that take an hour. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to take it an iron sword and and save it because there are some ingredient or some recipes that require a plain boring iron sword. Oh, the crafting. Yeah. It's, uh, do I want me to grab an iron mace for the same reason? Uh, Pretty good. Sure, yeah. Uh, what's your capacity? I'm over a bit. I'm over by six. Okay. Um, I'm um, walking slow. Well, you're not really doing swords, so I'm going to drop the sword. Yeah. Was there anything up here? Oh, uh, this is the way back. Ah, uh, this is not the oh, way back. Uh, I'm going to super speed, because technically everyone should be dead right now. Yeah. Just looking around. Got a bow. Bow. Yeah, I think we're good. We cleared it. And that shield is worth like a few hundred, so we suddenly have some cash. Yeah, right. I'll get my boots. I'll have a complete set. That shield is actually so good that you can go most of the game with just that one shield. True, yeah. And we're just throwing it away. It knows what it did. <laughs> yeah, did, does it? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just... I'm putting my camera close to the wall and clipping through the helmet to show me my character's <laughs> face. Okay, we just we just hide that. That's all right. I really wish the hair. I mean, that's the story, right? <laughs> oh, uh, but the helmet's too heavy. I can't oh no! Take the the. Oh, sorry, you were written on me. I didn't realize you got past me. All right. Uh, let's get back to Sierra I think we could talk to the lady now and be like, hey, we saved the city. And she'll give us and something. And she'll be like, here you go. You can enter my private vault, which we're going to restock stuff in soon. Every you seven know, days. Something. Every seven days, we're going to restock our vault so you can rob us. We owe you a blood debt now. <laughs> <laughs> and that blood debt is random, like, first area tier loot. I think... I think there's at least a brutal weapon in that box, which is pretty nice. Yeah. Something. Yeah, this is outward. It's weird. It's jank. It feels unfinished, but it's fu it is fun. It is. I mean, you can throw anything in a if it's an expansive co-op world with like good build craft or whatever. It's going to be fun. Don't think too hard about it. It's going to be fun. <laughs> As long as it doesn't break like System Shock 2 did. As long as it yeah. functions. If it's you have fine. functional co op, and even this, this is very janky co op, right? Oh, yeah. Like the number of times I've completed a quest and it's just given you some stuff or that skill thing at the very start. Yeah, the everything goes to the host player for some reason. Um, some of the aggro decisions. Combat not being good. Not, um, and combat not sinking. Properly for yeah. everyone. These these sorts of things are all. You can ignore all of that if you just do the. It's just co-op. <laughs> it's just co-op. I would not play this game single player if it had no the problem. No. I thought about it, but it's like the moment you take a bad hit and you go down, then you have to do all that weird, like getting moved around and your stuff taken from you, and then you gotta go get it back and. It's just a real pain. Whereas with God, multiplayer, Mountain Blade, 
heard the same thing where there's no true fail state, but no. when you lose, you'll kind of get enslaved. You're being dragged around in a prison caravan for a month. All your skills go down. Your army that you spent like the past six hours building is just gone. And it's like, because oh, you right. took a stray arrow directly in the eye and died without any, like, you didn't, you didn't, there was no counterplay. You just fucking died. Yeah. And it's like, Which oh is, boy. That's very realistic. Oh boy, it is. That, that is a, roughly how I imagined it. Uh, war Need is something. Oh, what? No. Thanks. What? Who? Oh, they're thanking us for being cool. It's for you. Cool. Oh, oh, I, let's, oh, let's go there right now. on our right over there. Okay. Well, actually, I'm going to lighten my load first. Something you need? Yeah, no kidding. Okay, don't want the Gladius or this or this. I actually didn't have too much on me from that venture. That's okay. 270 bucks for this shield. Ooh. I'm going to get the last of my armor. Awesome, do it. Yeah, you're going to be a huge fucking tank now. That's a really good way to start... Uh, Honestly, starting the game in general. Alright, so here's the vault. Here's the chest. A recurve bow. Okay. That's actually really good. Oh, yeah. That's that's for me. Compact bow, which inflicts slow down on enemies, too. Ooh. That's really good. Uh, it's a bit more damage. A tiny, like, two more impact. So it's five more damage. Hey, it's, it's good, though. Question is, is it heavier? It's four versus three. It's a it's a pound heavier. We'll see if that causes problems. Cool. All, all right, I got a new bow. This is probably the same tier as brutal for like melee weapons. Yeah, I would assume out there. Wait a second. And every not that we're gonna be here that often in the future, but if, if we wanted to, we could keep getting infinite money from that if we just kept sleeping for like weeks straight. Mm -hmm. What could I do for you? All right. Uh, let's see. Anything else I want to clean up before we head out? Um. Let me just put a bunch of shit away. Greetings, friend. Ooh, this guy does have a luxury tent. If you want to spend oh, 200 bucks. Buy... I'm going to buy an alchemy kit. It's my next thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, mostly so that I can try and build. Try some things with these arrows. Sure. I want to solve that mystery now before. <laughs> before uh, I spend too much money on arrows. Exactly. Um, I should probably sell these. Yeah, okay. Alchemy kit. Use alchemy kit. Cannot apply wood to alchemy kit. Okay. So then that can't be how arrow is made, unless maybe I just can't make them. That'd be kind of silly in a craft in a crafting game like this. That'd be kind of silly. Yeah. Oh wait, no, I don't have any wood because I used the wood to make the campfire. Give me one second. I must conclusively prove this. <laughs> I can use wood. Crab eye. Oh. Wood. Crab eye. All right. I can't figure it out. Maybe we'll come to the internet later. But... Maybe we'll just magically learn by next time. <laughs> It'll be so strange if that were to happen. Yeah, right. All right. Um, so very strange. I think this is a pretty good stopping point. Yeah, I agree. We no longer have any time pressure left in the entire game. We resolve both of those, and they never come back. That's right. Uh, there is a time pressure later, but we trigger the start of it, so it's not really, not really that bad. Mm -hmm. It's like a war or something. Don't don't worry. We're not worried about war. No one cares about a war. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. Uh, I think we're gonna keep going with this. We're also moving really fast, like really, really yeah, fast. Yeah, seriously. Uh, it turns out, having played the game before and recently, uh, we're good at it. <laughs>
We haven't had a KO yet, actually. Oh shit, that's right. Yeah, we haven't actually fully died. Some time on the floor, but Sh uh, yeah, but that's just part of the experience. That's normal. Admi uh, and uh, admiring the floor a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thanks again. Thanks for joining me, Frosty. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. See you guys next time. Bye bye.